No, it's six months. And whether you thought he was overwhelmed by the WWE before last Friday, and whether you went or on it, or woo, I've always been about three things and dedication. Now, but the one thing I'm not is we'll always do more. Thumbnail. Thumbnail. <laughs> Hi. Well, hi, y'all. <laughs> y'all feel so stupid. <laughs> oh, Christmas was yesterday, and you guys know I've been sick with the flu. And I say, you know what? I'm going to give my people what I want. I promise y'all went to Walmart about this outfit, y'all. Let me, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me rock it for y'all. Bam! Bam, bam, bam! <laughs> And I told Auntie Mom, I said, look, I'm going to go live. We're going to cook some breakfast. We're going to take down the Christmas tree. I didn't get a chance to open my Christmas present, y'all. So y'all come on in. <laughs> I laugh myself. I got to go use the bathroom, y'all, because I don't if I don't stop laughing so hard. I'm going to pee my pants, and I don't want to do that. So I'll be right back. Y'all come on in. Don't be still a little sore, but that's all right. We ain't going to stop us from having this sensational Saturday. Salute and hope you guys are having a wonderful 2023. It's the first Saturday of the 2023. Then another day, it's going to start being the second thing of 2023. So, Joshua Gabriel, how you doing, darling? Good to share my first, my very first, and my only first Saturday of 2023 with you, J Joshua. Come on in, y'all. Give me one minute. I'll be right back. Yeah, like, share me out. Thank you for that thumbs up, baby. Much love, much love. And Joshua, I'm going to drop your links, babe. Yeah, you're the first in the place. But Joshua, Israel, Joshua, the first. Never the last, but the first. And if y'all see what's going on in here, I got to tackle that tree over there. You probably see, I'm see, look at mom, see mama's boy sleeping. So my he ready to eat. <laughs> but anyway, y'all. Yes, I'm going to hear, yes, right. I hear about first star play. That's right. You better know it. Three people in the building, two thumbs up. Y'all going to smash like that, uh, smash that like button for me. Let me take on this bacon, y'all. We're going to cook first. I'm on. Breakfast with Carolina Jones. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So while that's going, y'all, I'm going to put a little bit of water. And I found my bacon, turkey bacon, that is. And we're going to sit down at the top. Feliz Navidad. Hey. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> Jump off. Good morning. Hey, I'm not the Grinch. I'm just the uh, the last angel right before the last Christmas, which was yesterday. You know, you guys are down south. No matter where you're old Christmas, January 6th, because... Historically, um, when we came over the ship as slaves with the African American slaves, everybody been a slave, would celebrate Christmas on the 6th of January because you know the, the, the plantation owner used to have their little hold downs, but the 6th, they always give us black folks the day off. You know, that's what I learned in history, and that's why we call January 6th or Christmas. Matter of fact, we used to celebrate January 6th in Africa back in the days of before the uh slavery trade. And uh, we became the master race that built up America. You know, as black people, I'm not saying I'm not racist, but I'm glad the fact that I'm saying it loud. I'm black and I'm proud. James Brown. Ooh. Yes, sir. Yeah. But that's a little, uh, since trivia was yesterday, trivia, National Trivia Day was yesterday. Just saying that is trivia right now. For, if you didn't know it, part of black history. And that's why January 6th is considered old Christmas. So Christmas was yesterday, and the days are seven, so I'm taking my tree down today. And I'm not going to push it back in the room. I'm going to unbox it. Yeah, but I'm going to sit down. What's going on, John Paul? What's up, Canada in the house? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And Joshua Gabriel, I love that Christmas song. Me too. That That's that's the hit for holiday. That's right. And Mariah Carey, what's she sing our song? What is it? 
All I want for Christmas is you. Y'all know I'm not gonna spend all day singing no Christmas song because my throat is gone. But right now, um, baby's going good. Give me some coffee. Y'all gonna sit down to talk. John Paul, good morning, baby. I got that PS5 going on back over there. I was playing the same game you were playing. I love that Puff the Magic Dragon. I gotta get your game tag so I can beat your booty, show you how to win, baby. John Paul, I like the way you travel, but do your I said you must have a thousand deaths back there on the <laughs> But the chick said, we ain't gonna die again. But anyway, Joshua, y'all get to know each other. John Ball is an outstanding mentor of mine that lives in Canada, along with Jesus Freak. And um, you, I'm sure you know him from John Ball. Not too many people on Facebook don't know John Ball because he's like a, a YouTube guru. Hello, beautiful from Michael Thomas. Yes, that's, I know who that is. One TSB. But anyway, um, Feliz Navidad. Happy New Year. Happy Holidays. Nate the Great Podcast. Blessings said, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Don't you look good in blue there, Nate? And yeah, I'm going to, um, what I'm going to do, there you go. Drop your links, get to know each other. You got a premiere coming out today. Let us know. So I put you on the community tab and watch you myself. Boom, shakalaka. Y'all, I am hungry, so I got to make sure this bacon get unthought real quick. Yeah, because I'm going to cook. We're going to eat, take down this tree, and then, how's it that? I don't know. I was going to do stream yard this morning, but I was like, nah, not yet. Maybe later on. Because I got a lot of people I want to go visit, like John Paul and Joshua. Yeah, and I want to run y'all um some of y'all movies today, make the playlist go up. Whoever come here in this chat while I'm cooking, that's what I'm doing today. Catching up on YouTube, I'm bored, you know. I can only go so much. I'm tired of going so live, and that's why we why people we lose subscribe. We go live too much. Let people go see somebody else, you know. Don't don't hug up that algorithm. Get get in, jump in, jump out, jump in, jump out. Hey. Yeah, but you know, you know, it's your channel. Do what you got to do. But me, I figure I don't want what you guys get bored of me. So I'm going to jump in and jump out today and let somebody else take the look. Y'all feel me? Uh, I know that's right, Nate. Well, let me get this coffee going on. Jump off. Tell me something good, baby, about YouTube. Jump off. Tell everybody why YouTube is taking these all uh, these subscri subscribers. I'll help you out one purging over camps. Then I'll jump all going to tell you why and how can we stop this from taking our, um, our subscribers and our watch time hours. Can you tell them why Mr. John Paul, because he is a YouTube guru? I got 15 emails. Like, Caroline, I'm going to do by my subscribers. And I tell them all the time. I say, get on YouTube. You're going to lose subscribers. Don't worry about it. I'm going to do you. Nobody. Nobody. Y'all, look. Let me tell you what I'm about to do. This bacon is on top at least five slices. My oven's already eating 350. Okay. Mama's boy sleep right now. So we're gonna start smelling bacon. You're gonna jump up. But y'all can y'all see what I'm doing? It's very easy. I ain't got to do all that because y'all not making put turkey bacon in the stove. All y'all know how to cook, y'all go. All y'all know how to cook. I know y'all do. But what I'm doing is wash my meat right now, y'all. And I'm going to take, uh, I will take care of them. Oh. Yes, I'm going to need Wash the meat, wash the meat. I already had it in some water, y'all. So, you know, I'm putting five long strands over here. I'm going to give me a little a kit to my micro camera so y'all can see everything I'm in. I ain't dragging that damn laptop. I'm going to give me a... Um, also, a uh, tripod. I got a tripod, but I don't like screaming for my phone. I don't. Somebody come to you. Live, Mister. It's two, y'all. Did y'all watch wrestling last night? Y'all wrestling gurus. Did you know that uh, Sami Zayn almost got his ass whooped by Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns. Cause he the reason why him and Sheamus lost that fight. But Kevin Owens came and said, "Yeah, motherfucker, it ain't my his fault." It's your fault because you scared of me. So they're going to fight for WrestleMania 2023. Sami Zayn, who? Sami Zayn, Kevin Owens, Roman Reigns, and uh, uh, Kevin Owens is going to fight. And Kevin Owens is going to win. He's going to become the next, I think, in my own opinion, he going to, Sami Zayn going to have Kevin Owens become the next champion. Yes, uh, Friday Night Smack got a wrap, dude. Y'all see Big Swag come back and take that damn bed from running around. So that shit was funny as hell. 
Anyway, y'all, I'm getting I'm almost, I'm almost done. I'm going to sit down and. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of. Uh, let's see, I put eight uh, things of bacon on my my bacon pan, glass bacon pan, which came from my grandma. I love to cook it. So I'm going to stick this in the stove for about 15 minutes, well, 20 minutes, 10 minutes on each side at a um, 425. Bacon. This is the best way to cook. Now, y'all got those high blood pressure, that cholesterol. Guess what? Do it that way. Don't fry it. Bake. Turkey bacon is an awesome choice over traditional bacon, even though I know you guys, like, I don't want to give up my pork. But turkey bacon is better to me than the pork pork. Besides, the cholesterol level go down. You start walking. Be like John Paul around 25 miles. Boom, shakalaka. That's one good way to start your healthy diet for 2023. But let me wash my hands, y'all, so I can talk to y'all. Because all I'm doing is grit, bacon, toast, cheese and eggs, and what? That's it. Grits. I didn't say it already. So I'm going to take the remaining bacon that I took out. I drain the water and put it back in the fridge. I got to really wash my hands, y'all. And then when you wash meat, it takes all that dog on nasty. You know that, that uh, excuse me. When you wash your bacon, the turkey bacon, or even bacon, regular bacon, what kind of bacon? Lamb bacon, I don't care what kind of bacon you have. That water will wash all that fat, that extra fat out. And then some people like to put it in the microwave. You take two uh, paper towels, place them on there. No, I'm going to put no more than three in it. Or six cut in half. Cook it for two minutes. Flip it over, drain it. You got some um, microwavable bacon. I don't like microwavable bacon because I, I like to cook. I want my food to come out. I got prepared and I got to put my love in it. We call that shit called soul food. When you put your soul, your foot in it, that's how you cook it. Well, I'm going to sit down and talk to y'all because I am hungry, hungry. And we're going to jump this thing up to 425. But I'm hungry, shit. Y'all know why I'm hungry. I probably got the munchies. I'm going to drink my last cup because y'all know I'm going to do it. I'm about to give me some dad mountain living. That's what I'm going to do. I like coffee, but I don't want too much coffee. I don't want to get anxious, you know? I'm going to drink this cup of coffee. And happy Saturday, y'all. Happy sensational Saturday. Sit down and read the chat, y'all, because I know I'm going to get hot in a minute. So let me check. I'm going to get hot, especially that stove on. And this hat right here, y'all, I swear, it gets warm. When Walmart sells some good Christmas stuff, for um, you might be an outfit, you wear it to a party, uh, office party, and they get warm. So, you know, well, quality is at um, Walmart. So let's read the chat. Going back up, guys. I'm going to get a sip of this coffee. My throat is on fire. James Gabriel said, hi, Carolina. And uh, James Gabriel. I swear I'm feeling like Mr. Mountain Dew. Uh, I know. Y'all know what I'm saying. And give me a thumbs up from James Gabriel. You guys can go ahead and drop your links. Y'all in the blue. Y'all know what to do. Blessings and highly favor. Thank you. Thank you, my friend. God bless you and yours. Um, he says he's uh, I'm first place. There you are. Yes, Joshua Gabriel. You know, I love your name because you remind me of Angel and um, uh, the prophet Isaiah in the Bible. So you have a very strong, strong name given to you by somebody who obviously loved God. And that's a great name to be named. I have to such great ones in the Bible like that, you know. My mother thought about calling me Angel and all that. No, she looked at me, called me Stacy Lee. She was watching this uh, soap opera called, uh, what do you call it, Edge of Night? <laughs> come on to a little channel now. I was like, damn, drama. What? Me? Stacy Lee? Well, come on. At least I'm sweet like Sarah Lee. The cake that is. I was always wanting to call Stacy Denise, but, you know, I, I love my name because one third of my family members, y'all, this heck got to come on. One third of my family, members, I know my hair's a mess, but one third of my family members are middle name, middle name is Lee. Lee, L E E, mine, L E I G H. Depends on how you spell it, L Y E E. Yeah, different names because you know how we, some of us African American, we like to take names called Shaniqua. Make sure you can't smell it. Put that French accent to it. Yes. Well, yeah, yes, I'm a hero. Morning. Uh, John Paul says, coming from Canada. I come from a land down under. Yeah, I remember that. I love Christmas music. Me too. Police Navidad, oh say, oh, oh say, 
Can you see by the dawn's early light? Not a Christmas song. What so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming. Soldier song. Whose bright stripes and bright stars to the peril let's fight for the ramparts we watch. Yeah, yeah. Was so gallantly streaming. And the rockets rang glad, bombers bursting in air, gave proof to the night that our flag was still there. Watch with it. Oh, say does a star spangled banner yet wave. Oh, the land of the free and the home and the home of the brave play ball boom shakalaka <laughs> we wish you a merry christmas wish you a merry christmas we wish you a merry christmas and a happy new year. Much love, y'all. Y'all look, look, I don't know. I missed your, 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 your things up because my throat's scratching. Lord have mercy. It started at 39 degrees. Y'all supposed to get it at 65. This is new morning weather. Five and five. Five people building. Five thumbs up. Your mama's boy already woke up because he smelled the bacon. Yeah, but anyway, I had to take that hat on my head. That shit get hot, y'all. Look at it. And look, my pony, this is my hair. Just hair. Shoot. I pull this thing out and shake it like it's I'd be like Mariah Carey up in here. <laughs> no, I'm just playing y'all. But reading the chat, morning all. I love Christmas song. That's uh, that's the hit for holiday. That's right. Yep, I love Silent Night, but the best one I really like. Oh, come all ye faithful, joyful and triumphant. Oh, come let door him Christ the Lord. Oh, this one. I'll play my drum for him. For um, pa, bum, bum. Play my drum. Yes. Nate, the great podcast is blessings to the chat. Blessings to you, my darling. But is welcome to the stream. Nate, the great podcast. Y'all better check on my bacon. <laughs> anyway, y'all. I, oh, here we go. It's, now, look. I'm sitting there trying to push that thing down to read my chat. I need my glasses too, y'all. But y'all bear with me. But is welcome to the stream, Nate, the great podcast i hear ya great podcast i really don't like doing uploads i really do shorts or, or lives yes besides no one gonna sit through no one gonna sit through 30 minute uploads. i'll tell you what something yes i have one auntie mom i'll sit there all day i'm dating watch her shit over and over and over again miss fucking one of a new hussy over and over and over again john paul over and over again book and chick boom over and over again Yes, if your content is great enough, guess what? You can keep my retention span. I'm going to sit there and watch. And if you my buddies, I'm going to watch. You, Nate, you got some good cooking, I'm going to watch. Okay? Because the best YouTube videos you can do is informational, instructional videos at boom. will just make people laugh. Have a cute dog. Yes. I love it. And people sit around and watch my shit all day long because I try to do something entertaining. Um, even though I got God in me, I'm Christ-like. So don't think that because I'm a PKD that I'm... Mother Teresa, because I'm not. Nobody is, you know. But I like to make people laugh. Pass the bacon. You better know it. Pass the bacon. Hey. Mayhem and miracles in the house, right? That's right. That's right. That's right. And thank you for that 100% there, you, Nate, the great podcast, because I'm going to be looking at your stuff all day today, too. Anybody come in? That's what I'm going to do. You know, because I love promoting other people. And running eggs on 007, uh, Super Chat, they'll tell you all that. Did anybody hit that damn Mega Me last night? Y'all did it. I checked my ticket. The only number I had was 20. Shit. There was no Powerball either. Powerball my mama's birthday, June 13th. I was like, hot diggity damn. I went, but I went and got me a, um, a random. Uh, a, I got me a random ticket. I didn't put my special numbers in. But if I would put my special number in, I probably right now I probably have about a million dollars. Because I was cold already getting crap out of this store, y'all. You know what I'm saying? 
Sometimes we need to slow down and listen to your heart for God trying to tell you. Because I tell you right now, if I would play the numbers I wanted to put, I've been a billionaire. Well, I wouldn't say a billionaire. $777 would be mine. Now it's supposed to be up to one billion. Nobody hit that jackpot. But y'all was getting a little chill in here. So I need to wash my hair and do something with it today. Don't know what I'm doing yet. But right now, we're going to do this today. Because I'm going to take down that tree. Tell you really, y'all know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you quick what to take it down. Now, not the moment where I'm coming. I'm gonna slide that bitch back in the back room. <laughs> yeah, I take it down. Oh shit, no, I ain't messing with it. And then I'm looking at all them prayers. I might just do it tomorrow. Shoot, because I see, you know what? I'm gonna enjoy it. I mean, every day is gonna be Christmas. And I remember I was watching my favorite one of my favorite um, army uh, army shows, and it was talking about the ski airman. Uh, you might know it. Um, it's got Morgan Freeman in it, and it's called Glory. And this guy is from South Carolina. You know, I'm at the state line. He says, Christmas, he's from Charleston, South Carolina. He said, Christmas should be every day. Sound Jamaican. But uh, yeah, Creole people got that French gender. I'm, I'm going to take my grandma has had Cherokee, white, and she's also French. She's high yellow, mulatto. We call it mulatto is a trans, transaction meaning high yellow. That means she's mixed French and white, but Indian. So, but my mama, my grandma, my grandma, I would say I'm a woman of color, you know. I'm a mixed breed. Ain't no color in heaven. So it doesn't matter about my color, it matters about what I produce inside for God. Ain't no color in heaven, baby. I'm here to tell you. But if you call me the N-word, I'm gonna let your ass from the tree. My grandma come from old school, baby, Louisiana, baby, Mississippi. You talk shit to call them a nigga. They're like a white man, black man don't wear no sheets. She's proud, sister. Very proud. You know what I'm saying? She's part of the disturbance. And when we she say one thing, man, you better believe it. Miss Bala started with Kirkley. She didn't play, honey. And when we come to ass whipping, she get all of us. So she said, I ain't gonna have no weak links in my and this family. You're gonna be strong and act like it's strong. Don't be messing up. When I whip your ass, I'm whipping everybody. Ass. And she ain't play, y'all. Thank God for them butt whoops. But uh Mayhem and Miracle says, uh, hello, hello, hello. Hello, three people really simple things like y'all are so sweet. I ain't been with 22 minutes. Y'all showing me some love today, ain't you? Much love to y'all. Like, share me out. You know, get some people over here. I'm trying to reach 1K, y'all. And so far, I don't even know what it is. I ain't looked at it because I don't really worry about numbers. But I know I picked up two beautiful people today. Nate, the great podcast because he cooks. Yeah, Auntie Mama's chat. And there was somebody else. Mayhem, you know, I love it. Much blessing to you, baby. I'm trying to get better, y'all. I am. I am. I got I'm not Auntie Mama. She tell y'all, oh, Stacy taking, uh, taking some of that. Uh, what the hell does she call it? Plop, plop, biscuit. Oh, what a relief it is. And that's what I'm taking. Um, Auntie Mama cooking right now, so I know she's going to catch me on the playback. Probably catch me later because she's doing some stuff right now. But wow, man, they clean up that, that yard. That yard looks good. Y'all to check out the shorts. It's phenomenal. And uh, I'm so glad that she uh got that playing clip. Uh, hi, Nate, in the great podcast. Y'all see some people in here go about the channel. Boom, smash that like button. First of all, when you go there, like, subscribe, comment on a couple of their videos. You might get a new friend for your channel. Boom, shakalaka. I can't make you, but I highly, highly suggest that if you want to get with some great content, creator, look at the ones in the blue, okay? My eyes red, y'all. Y'all know because I went live stream this early this morning, couldn't sleep, and I started having a good time. I, I guess I went, I went live. I don't know what time it was. Until my mom said, where's your live at? So I got up and I did a live, and I was waiting for Cindy Lopez, but she never showed up. So I guess I end up just doing what I do. Last night, you know. What's going on, Torture Blaine? Awesome, babe. What's going on? Happy Saturday to you. Happy New Year. First Saturday of 2023. Y'all doing with me, Carolina D. That's up, that's up, that's up. Mayhem says, hello, Torture Blaine. Yeah, show that love, baby. And Torture Blaine says, good morning all. Nate, the podcast. Yeah, lit, lit, lit. You dang right. We boom, lit. Yes, lit. Fire. Because fire. Yes. Torture Blessing says, okay. Lady J, what's up, darling, my daughter? Miss Nicole. Nicole's world's up in the building. Yes, she is. Boom, shakalaka, my daughter. Oh, God, I love you so much, baby. And tell my grandson, I said, hello, Steve Gilmore, YouTube, checking in peace and blessings. Much love to you, too, darling. And thank you, darling. Ashley, my daughter, saying, okay, mom, you're doing all right. Good. I'm watching you. <laughs> I love her, too. But, uh, you know, she's so awesome. She got my grandbabies, honey, and I love her. Salute. Boom, 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 boom. I'm much love. I love you to the moon and back, Miss Lady J. Steve Gilmore up in the house, checking in peace and blessings. Blessings to you, my brother. Steve Gilmore, salute, salute, salute. That's right. Salute. Y'all know how we do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
Shout out to everyone in the chat coming from Steve Gilmore. Yes, sir. Motivation. Oh, my God. Not my boy. Weightlifting geek coming out. Motivation from the weightlifting geek. Sir, my dear friend, what's up to you, baby? Much love to you. Um, motivation with the weightlifting geek. Honey, I'm going to get my swerve on next. I'm starting tomorrow. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying my last day of Christmas for uh, old Christmas. You know, old Christmas last yesterday. Take down the tree and start a new. I don't do resolution, but I will do a diet and <laughs> work out. <laughs> so I'm glad to see y'all up in the building. Six people in the building, nine thumbs up. Y'all better go and smash that like button. Y'all, I got to put y'all. I'm, today, this is what I'm going to do. And I get get out live. I'm going to see all of y'all. Put y'all in my community tab. And if you ain't got no content, boom, I'm going to subscribe to you anyway. Maybe one day you just feel like you want to get your own YouTube channel. You know what I'm saying? My daughter, she don't want nobody to see her, but she's starting her little Nick Nicole's world. So when she ready to get support, I'm going to boom, we're going to go out and just raid her channel. But my daughter, she's kind of private, you know. She'll test the water and be like, hey, no, nah, that's not for me. So when she get ready, I want y'all to know, I'll let you know. Lady J, they can be in the building. Much love, darling. See, you're going to say motivation. Dedication. You won't break my soul. You won't break my soul. Keep me right, Ashley. Keep me on break my soul. The words of song. But I love that, that uh, Bianca song. Motivation. Yeah. Uh, motivation. From the weightlifting geek, yeah. What's good, fam? Steve Gilmore, YouTube up in the house, y'all. Y'all, I'm almost about to hit that 1K. 1K. Trying to make a K. I can't make K. Got to have another arm. But you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but anyway, um, y'all got to check on this bacon. Uh, Steve uh, Gilmore, YouTube channel. Thank you so much for the thumbs up. Mayhem and miracles in the house. Yes, yes, yes. Steve Gilmore saying, send a love and Holy Ghost. Yes, sir. I feel you, baby. Holy Ghost up in the building. Boom, yes. Yes, that's Lady J. Uh, Steve Gilmore uh, speaking to my daughter, Lady J. Steve Gilmore speaking to Joshua Gabriel. Lady J and Joshua Gabriel got the most angelic names I have ever heard. Yeah, I gave my daughter her name. And this, uh, we all got names. Everybody got a blessed name. You know what? When I get up to him, I want the Lord to call me by name. Stacy Lee, little. Good job, my faithful servant. Well done. That's all I want to hear. My Lord say, well done, well done. Well done, well done, well done. All I want my Lord to say is well done, well done, well done. Hallelujah, y'all. Motivation is glad to glad to be here. Says I'm glad to have you, my brother. God woke us all up this morning. You better thank the God above. Yes, sir. Don't thank me. But thank him. Hallelujah. Y'all up in the building with Carolina Diamond. God is love, and I love all of y'all with a godly love. Auntie Grandma said, Auntie, Auntie Mama says, Agape, I say golly. She say tomatoes, I say tomatoes. Same thing. Muy, muy, yeah, muy, 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 muy de amor. Much love. Motivation salute, bro. Everybody sitting here, uh, everybody um, sitting here uh, showing love to each other. Nate, motivation. Take that, my daughter said, take that hat off. No, no, I'm not taking off Ashley Nicole. <laughs> She don't want me to wear that. Get me to take my freaking Christmas tree down. I bought this from Walmart. Y'all know my daughter, when she came home, I said, I'm going to wear this to my mama party. She said, you is, mom, I ain't going. So for some reason, she heard my, my other daughter, Kiki, convinced me not to wear this to her. And I was going to work it, twerking her. Let me see what I'm going to have on. My half course is going to be in curls rolled up. Check it out, I'm y'all. And that's why she want me to take it out. Because when she was home, I bought this shit from Walmart. And I was going to have my black on, honey. My boots. Let me show you how. Let me let y'all see the decor. Y'all see these black shoes right here? Them, I was going to have me some black shoes on, honey. And have me a cat woman suit for this. Rail. I got pockets. I was going to come in like, my mama house be like, we wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. And tell my daughter, and a Happy New Year. And I've been fine as hell, and she knew <laughs> But, you know, for her and my daughters, I always let them take me out of my glory. I mean, plus, I was sick, y'all. I didn't feel like doing all that because my daughter didn't tell you I was sick, very sick. And that's why she want me to take this shit off. She don't like, she want her mama to be glammed up all the time. Honey, mama ain't got to be glammed up all the time. Dang. But anyway, she loved me. She just wanted the best for her mom. Yeah, Lady J, my baby Ashley. Happy New Year to you, Torja Blaine. You know, how we do, fam. Nate had the great podcast for, for sure. G's uh, motivation. 
from the weightlifting geek. You just advanced to level six. Boom, shaka locker. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what. And y'all, congratulations to me. Congratulations to me. Congratulations to me. I hit the hundred thousand views. Yes, we doing the damn thing. Yes, Lord. Boom, shaka locker. Yes. Army Strong, you better know it. Make the podcast 100%. MGTV in the house. Good boy. What's up, baby? Outstanding. Another outstanding YouTube celebrity in the building. She's been a while. She got over 6,000, about pushing 7K, 7,000 K. If you have not dropped your links to my sister, MTGV TV, you're wrong. You're wrong. Y'all need to go in there and hit. Y'all, matter of fact, all y'all in the blue need to touch base with one another. Drop your links, get to know each other. She is so great. She pulled me in. You know, a little old YouTube channel like me. I ain't got one K yet. She said, come on in, my friend. Because I was telling what YouTube was doing to me, taking all my dollars and subscribers. I was getting pissed. I said, mama said, this number's going to come in. I know, but YouTube need to back off me on it. I record on my channel. And I want my rendition. Because I should have been monetized last year. Because every time they do this big-ass purge, I lose three and four, five hundred subscribers all at one time. Y'all know this. I should have been. I should done this in two years. This, um, this is my third year anniversary. And then I took off a while. When my uncle and my auntie passed away, y'all know that. Hold on, give me a minute. Oh, that turkey baby smell oh so good. And I wish my grandson Josiah would eat the whole thing. My grandson Josiah, he's just like me. Y'all know that. He uh he eat funny. My daughter has to eat funny too. Certain things we like to eat, but I tell you one thing we all love them salmon patties around here. And that's what I'm cooking at dinner tonight. Salmon patties is amazing rice. That's me and my daughter's favorite dinner, y'all. I'm trying to find my life. Hold up, y'all. You won't break my soul. Motivation, yeah. Y'all gonna tell you the truth though. I love my fact my tree on this cold outside. So y'all know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take my tree down tomorrow. Who we'll promise you tomorrow? Choose a lot today. So much easier to say. Hey, tomorrow, promise you tomorrow. Choose a lot today. Hey. Oh, so much easier to say. My voice gone, but I'm trying, y'all. <laughs> There's a plea in the soul building, and I know I better save it for tomorrow, y'all. Save it for tomorrow. <laughs> well, I need to go get me some lemon and honey, y'all know that. Tone. Y'all know what? My Facebook is getting hacked like hell. It ain't getting hacked. I'm accepting new, new uh, subscribers. That's why I need to get my daughter, <coughs> who is my mastermind, Ashley, Lady J, <coughs> to make me a Facebook page with Carolina Diamond. Because when I when I'm not on my phone, my 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 Carolina was well, Stacy Lee. My Stacy Lee Facebook is for my family, and uh, you know I I put the little link on there when I first started YouTube, not realizing the impact that it has. Because my daughter and my, my grandkids want to call me, call me up. I'm going to get up. Now, sometimes I'll be live 3 o'clock in the morning. I click over and miss my live stream up. And I see that it uh, whoever called me, somebody from overseas or somebody want to want to know Carolina Diamond. So I'm going to get my daughter, Ashley, to just strategically make a um, Facebook page for me just for Carolina Diamond. Now, you guys, y'all love y'all moms, but my mastermind is Lady J because she always on me. Mom, don't wear this. Mom, don't say that. Don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do that. Mom, you have got to look good when you're representing us. I'm like, God, girl, I gave you birth. Help me out here now. Yeah, because, you know, she's my right hand, man. She's cancer like me, and we just feel each other. You know, I'm her mom, and, and she's mine, and she came out of me about to hell kill me, but hell, she came out, and I love her to the moon and back. But she's my advisor on everything. That's because she love me. I love her. So salute, salute. Y'all hashtag, hashtag y'all put this in the chat. Hashtag Lady J for being such a fabulous daughter. And y'all know what I'm gonna tell you really how y'all beautiful she is. Y'all know that 10 second clip she don't like, she don't like this, but she gonna get it today from my mom. She uh did that 10 second clip, happy new year. And that is Ashley. Ain't she beautiful, y'all? Y'all need to go check that out. And it's called um uh, my daughter giving me a shout out on YouTube. Check it out, 10 seconds, honey. And look, 
and like and come. You're like, oh God, she is so pretty. That's why all these guys calling me for uh uh, you ain't getting met my daughter. No, she don't want you. She's doing her, she's going to school, take care of her sons and her daughter, her son and daughter, her family. She ain't trying to find nobody. And you can't get to my child, you gotta come through me. Ask her ex boyfriend, child, the other person like a Mr. Hang on, name drop my Miss Charvis is all I'm gonna say. And y'all, I know y'all, I'm working on quit smoking cigarettes because I can tell you right now, 7 Eleven, Ashley, 7 Eleven, you know, how about 7 Eleven? 7 Eleven is a lucky day, and I'm gonna tell you, 7 Eleven, my Uncle Lee Melton, birthday is June 9th, rest in peace, and um, his son Terry. As the cousin, the love of death. She told me to tell you, hey, his name is Red Dog on the Red Dog Melton on Facebook. And he wrote me, told me they were having the videos of me and Uncle Lee having conversations. I'm like, yeah, shitload of them. So um, for this weekend, I'm going to do a dedication to my Uncle Lee Melton, who served over 30 some years in the, in the Army. And, you know, um, when I talk about him, tears come to my eyes because my Uncle Lee Melton, he's my road dog, my best friend. He always looking out for me. I be in the streets drinking. Get your ass in this car. Let's go home. Get in the car, let's talk about some soldier things. And we have conversations like that. And I'm going to call it the life of two great soldiers. And that's going to be my dedication to him. Roger that. Roger that. Roger that. And then I'm going to put it back in the archive. Roger. And every year of his birthday, I'm going to add a little something, something to it, which is July 9th. Mine's at 7. Ashley's at 30. We all cancers up here when it comes to this family, on this side of the family. And uh, he loved Ashley so much. And uh, he gave me a picture that Grandma Mary had. And Grandma Mary... My mom married the second time she married my dad, Mr. James Melton. And um, I call them grandma because, you know, it's out of respect because we don't do steps in this family. We don't. And that's my little sister's daddy, Erica. Because Erica and Ashley is real close. But, um, yeah, I'm going to do that. I don't want to talk too much because I'll start crying because my mom, uh, uh, her husband, James Melton, passed away. And then she had another boyfriend after that named George Brewer from Monroe. Um, you know, and uh, she lost two husbands. She did. She did. And I don't want to talk about it because I know my mama's in this chat because I see her now. But I want to say salute to uh, y'all hashtag Ashley Lady J because Lady J keeps me on my P's and Q's. And I love her so much. Yeah, anyway, uh, y'all, let's get back. Let me go check on this, baby. Y'all hold on a minute. We're going to be eating in a minute. Hold on. I'm going to get off here and let y'all enjoy y'all. I'm going to take my cookie down tomorrow, y'all. I don't feel like it. I don't feel like it. And I eat this good old food. I'm going to get the itis. And I'm going to be like, oh, God, YouTube, let's go. Boom. And I'm going to do my channel reviews. We're going to have a panel tonight, y'all. I don't know. I'm going to do the panel tonight at 7 o'clock when I'm going to do this do stream yard. Breakfast this morning. Uh, stream yard tonight. Boom. At 7 o'clock. So, y'all, what I'm doing is now I'm taking my... I'll turn on this. You got to sit on there. It's too easy. Can y'all see the oven? See the meat dripper. The, the meat dripper. Spoon. I'm going to do this. And my daughter get on me all the time about this. Mom, you gonna burn yourself? Kick it into my baby, other baby. Take it and flip it. Boom. Oh, no, it's nice and pretty. My grandson love my bacon, honey. He ain't eat the whole damn thing by himself. And I love it when they eat. Love it. And uh, there we go. Nice and smooth. And my daughter said, Mom, I ain't never seen nobody bake no bacon before. Yes, she have. You just don't remember. The auntie ain't anybody did it. She died baby, my, my mom, you know, uh, my mother's sister. And her brother raised me. But uh, I call her mom. Because she's the only mom I've known. I know my mom was my mama, so I'm about. I don't know. It wasn't what I was doing. As soon as I got, when I got five years old, my auntie adopted me. And my mama said, well, she raised me and your daddy. Might as well keep you there because my auntie didn't have any kids. And my mom, you know, she was like leaving my dad at the time. I was still a relationship with her second husband, James Melton. And uh, what I did was I, my aunt adopted me, and uh, she raised me, and she raised my daughter, Ashley, for a little while when I was in the Army as well. So me and Ashley, yeah, we more like sisters, but she is, she know I'm my mom. Yeah, because uh, my aunt didn't play. She didn't play, no. She mama dukes and play. I love my mama, but she, my mama, respect my auntie. She raised me, but it's all good, you know. At least I had both, life, both worlds, my mom. My dad, my uncle's boom right there in that one sector. Growing up down here is beautiful, honey. It was beautiful. It's probably the best thing I have known. You ain't had to tell me uh, to get out the house. Here we stay out the house. My mom would kick us out. Get out! Don't come knock on the door. And don't come on. I'm watching my dog on um. So Bob, don't she gonna put us work shelling peas? Oh Lord, who want to sell peas? Jesus Christ! I hated it. Oh no, 
All them bees get up your hands be so so shelling beans. I damn I hear <laughs> and going to the garden on Friday. I'm like, uh-uh, I'm gonna get me a job, so I don't have to do this shit. I got my first job at 14 years old. I ain't had to go to no garden. I was like, yes. But sometimes I had in my day I ain't like, come on, let's go get the garden, pick me butter bean. But it'd be worth it because I'm butter bean over. She used to cook low milk in the mouth that one to cook. Yes, she taught me how to cook, and it is. MGTV says, Good morning, Carolina. Good morning to you, darling. Uh, geez, MGTV, you just advanced to level what three? Go, girl. Torshi Blaine says, I love you. Saturday motivational message words. I am really going to try to live by. But thank you, honey. I try to do that every day because one thing I like to do, and my daughters will tell you, no matter what, what life brings you, if it gives you lemons, give it lemonade. If it gives you rocks, give it gold. It's how you it's how you live your life. You have got to have people. We got to motivate each other now because you know what? It's 2023. God going to bless you and me. But first of all, we got to walk the walk and be done. They're all the talk. You got to walk the walk. God get tired of us talking about we're going to do this. We're going to be better. When God didn't promise you tomorrow, he promised you today. He said, love me with all your heart and treat your folk, folks like you want to be treated. That's the greatest commandment at all. So why not do it in 2023? And that's why I do the motivational messages. I know everybody don't wake up happy every day. Because you know what? If you wake up every day, something fucking wrong with you. I'm going to tell you right now. You need to go see a psych if you're happy every day. You're addicted to something. It must be a new drug. Like Huey Lewis say, I want my name is, you know that Huey Lewis song. I love that too. Huey Lewis in the news. I love, I love rock music. I really do. But getting back to the point, I try to get motivation. I'm glad you find inspiration in my motivation. Because sometimes I have to be motivated. I get laying and be like, shit, ain't doing that. I'll get on the phone call my daughter. I'm like, Ashley, what you do? I'm like, oh, I better get my ass up. She can get up and raise a son. I raise them two of her. I can get up and do so. So Ashley, she don't know, but she motivates me in every way. And then she works so hard, two jobs, being a single mom she is. And I love her. I love her so much because I'm going to tell you right now, you like, ladies and gentlemen, you don't understand how hard it is to raise a son and a daughter single in D.C. area. Let me help you out. It's very hard. She worked two jobs and she take care of me. She don't think about no clubbing. She stay home, take care of my grandkids. And I love her for that. She's a homebody like her mom because family is very essential. You got to have family. And when my daughter, I look at her every day and I'm telling her, I'm so proud of her. Because right now, in these times right now, you got kids got COVID-19. They staying home. They went mask, no mask. They got this RV, uh, upper story respiratory. And I'm glad my grandson ain't been sick because she on it. Y'all remember that viral video of Mother's Love? It actually got about, I think, 2,000 views from that. When she was just sitting there scratching her ear, looking at her grand, my grandson, make sure he was okay because he was laying on the chair sick. 2,000 views. And that lets you know, people see how awesome mom you are, Ashley. I'm so proud of you, Lady J. I love you. But going down, y'all, I'm trying to check on make sure it don't burn. Okay, waiting. Hey, my dear friend, MGTV. And MGT said, Good morning, y'all. And Steve Gilmo says, MGTV, happy Saturday. Oh, how how so bot? You know how that body is, girl. That shit, that, that bot ain't nothing but uh botissimo. It makes you know better where tuba chat uses it. I got it from him. So I started using it. I like better than that night bot. That night bot should be timing people out, and I can't do that. No, let me tell my mods out. So I like this one better. It's a softer gentleman. Plus, you know, he also give you sponsors. You know, see if you get to my 10, you'll start seeing sponsorships, ways to save money. That does not go to me, but it goes to a homeless charity. Um, uh, di uh, disabled American veterans that I set up for. I don't get the money. They get it. So when you see levels go up and you need to click on one of the links and it'll tell you get 20% off candy or whatever, boom. That's what I'll go to. And a lot of people, my, my, my um, subscribers, have dedicated over a hundred, by over think four or five hundred dollars from that since I've been using this application. And then it says your sponsorship, but I need to go in and you know pick some things. Good morning. Um M oh good morning, MFTWGT. So that's motivation from the weightlifting geek. She's like, girl, I ain't got time to be typing all them names up and I'm gonna give me an acronym. That's what's up. <laughs> Hold on, y'all take on this bacon. You gotta flip it, rub it. Oh no, poison. That girl is poison. Anyway, y'all. What I'm about to do now, y'all, it's going to be real easy. Well, first of all, I'm going to turn this hot ass on, y'all. And while that's doing, y'all, hold up. I'm going to go ahead and get ready to do the rest. I meant to put my, I should have put my grits on. I was ready to run. I ain't cooking no grits today. Show here, right? No, I ain't cooking no grits today. We're cooking rice. I don't think I got more grits. Damn. And mama's boy sleep. Y'all, he's sick. 
Yeah. You gotta eat, so I gotta get something good sticking in the rear. And then yeah, that's eager to have such surgery again on the 13th. But he went and did some stuff with the doctor yesterday. So I just went out to you guys in the last video. You wanna know about his health? Check out the last video. So no, I don't accept. So right now, y'all, I got I'm gonna put a little bit of rice in here. Y'all, I do my rice different than anybody else. When I'm ready to eat, I just put the shit right in there. They throw the butter and then when it gets cooked, my cook tea to it. Everybody cook rice different. You ever notice that? They really do. So I'm getting my rice now. I'm about to have a cup of that. Take my bacon, I'm gonna sit down and talk. We're gonna take this rice for a while to cook. You gotta let the water boil, then throw my butter and season in. But today's gonna be, we're gonna push this right along because you need to eat because you're feeling a little weak over here, mama boy. Cheesy, cheesy breezy. So I put a, a, a half a cup of rice in there. I'm gonna turn it up on the seven because I want the ice and no high because I want to come to a boil and I'm gonna turn it back down. I'm gonna simmer. Get this dog on bacon up so it burn up. You don't want no bacon, nobody burn no burnt bacon. I can't stand burnt bacon, y'all. Don't want it, don't want to see it. So what I'm gonna do now is go ahead and take this out here. Take this out of here. Take this out of here. Take this out of here. Scoop it up. Scoop it up. Put it in a cup. I think mom got this thing here song. Get on up and get a cup. Okay, so y'all see that bacon right there? Y'all see the bacon, and what I do now to get some of that excess turkey bacon, I'll do this. Put a. I think y'all have been. I know it's early in the morning, y'all. So y'all gotta go. But this is how you stop all that extra fatty stuff on your bacon. You go ahead, put it in, flip it over, and let it continue to dry because this is better than the George Foreman. But you're doing it manually, so press it down, get all that grease. You see all that grease there? That's what going your, your arteries causes a uh, high cholesterol and High blood pressure. So you want to keep it down? Bake, baby, and get the excess off. Don't or go spend a whole lot of money on George Woman. You got it like that? Go get a George Woman. Me? Shit, no. Out the prison, I'm trying to get that bank account back up. Money, money don't grow on trees, baby. And eggs, seven dollars, seven damn dollars. I said, Lord, I think it put the gas going down. But what about the eggs? Give me two. Give me. Go. I'm gonna go get me five damn old chickens and get me a chicken coop out there. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm crazy, but I ain't that crazy. But actually, y'all, I'm gonna tell you right in Chesterfield. We're going to Chesterfield number nine, right here, state line. There's a there's a, 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 a nice young nice lady about she about 79, 80 years old. She got nothing but cheese and she sell her eggs, honey. And she said, My eggs ain't never three dollars. You need some eggs, come and get it. I don't shit up damn if I want. When you save a dollar, you earn money, honey. Yes, Lord. And y'all do shit up good this bacon here. My grandson be all this baby gone. Look. Nice and crispy. That's hot though. So, mm. right now, I'm waiting on the rice to come down. I'm gonna do the cheese and egg. I'm gonna put this in the microwave and let that, I let all that uh, grease come out of my bacon. So I'm gonna let the rice cook about ten minutes. That's about fifteen. We're gonna be ready. Hold on, y'all. Let me uh, warm this up and give me some more cup coffee. I'm gonna finish this. Check. I've been live forty eight minutes already. I can't even believe. It. And y'all gonna tell you how funny my daughter is. Somebody she don't know what cool lady. I was drinking for a hook to my house and shit. When I was when I was in the army making all that money, we drank cool lady in my house. That's our favorite drink. Drink. My my favorite is uh, chocolate punch. Ashley is watermelon and crumble and uh, red candy. My daughter she like lemonade. Other daughters she like lemonade. I don't like that lemonade. I don't. I really don't. But see, and then what I'm going to do now, Kool-Aid, all you got to do, Kool-Aid. Too late to this. Ask this Kool-Aid. You remember mama used to pop it open? She used to be playing with me. I know she be playing with me. She know Kool-Aid is. I taught her how to make me. She was about four or five years old. Put one, one of these in a two quart cup of sugar, stir it up. Boom, get you a cup. Boom, you got the purple drink drink. <laughs> They to be a called Kool Aid purple drink drink. So much for that. Yeah, I'm gonna put that rice on number on nine to it boil. Got my cup. I'm gonna finish this chat. 
I'm writing. I'm writing. I'm writing, writing, writing. Yeah, my mom's boy still asleep, so trying to be extra quiet. You know, I had the nurses I asked, girl, how I need them got up. Went to the doctor yesterday, got up, got some of them gallstones out of his ass, and then look at him now. Went somewhere, and now he hurting. Men are so hard. I said, Mom, you write right about that shit when you're in your live chat today. Men are hard headed. They want to do their own thing. And then they come back and act like a baby boy, won't be pitted. Mm hmm. He got a mama sitting his ass down and get pitted. He don't listen to me, hard headed. Okay, anyway. <laughs> well, anyway, as long as you hear, I'm always going to take him because we're friends like that. We're not talking anymore, but I still care about Mr. Myers a great deal. We call him Mama's boy, Stoner boy, because he smokes so much Reva. All he do is lay on the chair and put a hole in the motherfucker. <laughs> Matismo says, weep and weep and... Okay, let me, I missed somewhere. Good morning, Steve, coming from MTGV TV. Torches says, nice to meet everyone. Steve and Gilmore YouTube channel is dropping his link. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all go check him out because every day he gives us a daily word. And if you have not smashed that like button, like, share, man, please do so. Steve Gilmore on YouTube says, weep. Weep and may do it for a night, but joy comes in the morning. Ain't that right, brother? I can testify to that. I like the way you said it. And all, oh, I appreciate you. MGTV, you know we appreciate you as well. See, we're talking about microphone and hear applause. Yes, I can sing. Boy, may be raspy, but guess what? Give me some honey. I'll be like Mariah Carey. Oh, you know what? She's Lillian Dion. I love her too. Once more, you open the door. I'm something that life goes on. Near far, wherever you are. I love that song. And y'all know Celine Dion is not the top 200 uh, all, all um, best singers. I think that's crazy, y'all. But Tissimo says, Steve. Steve done got connected. But Tissimo got connected. <laughs> Steve said, but Tissimo got connected. Yes, you really have to be safe on Facebook. You write about that, Torture Blaine. You are right, baby. Steve said, Torture Blaine done got connected. Yep. My condolences to your dear uncle. Thank you, MT GBTV. Yeah, he died of COVID about three years ago. Yeah, Uncle Leroy. And my aunt, she passed away on my birthday. The one that raised me in July 1996. Me and my daughter had the opportunity to go out there to the grave when she was home. My grandson was there to see, you know, us talking to him and putting, hold on, y'all, I'm turning this rice down. My grandson was there. We saw the grave, so I thought that was kind of a a unique spiritual thing that my, my auntie and my uncle, the one that raised me, was able to see Ashley home that raised that she had raised, and my grandson was there, you know. To me, I felt the Holy Ghost got connected, and my uncle and them came out to church, Uncle Will, Uncle Fred, y'all coming to church? And my aunt was like, nope. <laughs> so they knew she was home, but they wanted to come out there and squeeze her, especially my godmother, Aunt Lucille Little, which is my cousin, but you know, it is what it is. I have a lot of godmothers. I do. And that's it does too. I mean, that's what church, Cedar Creek Baptist Church, my uncle Fred is a minister. But back then, my honorable, my uncle, Reverend uh, G.B. Lewis was a pastor. Right now, uncle, um, uncle Reverend Lewis passed, not passed away from Alzheimer's. He was like 99 years old. You know, he lived a great life, but you know, when you, when you touched by God, one day you gotta be with him because I do know, even though we don't feel it sometimes when we lose a loved one, to be absent from the body is to be with God. And I know there we're all gonna go to a better place. And one day, when the rapture comes, God races all up to the new heavens. We'll see each other with new bodies, new minds, just singing "Holy is the holiest." Yes, and whoa, oh, what a great day it shall be! Yes, Jesus. Mm. I don't worry about tomorrow. I, I don't even worry about what's in this world because I'm not in it. I mean, I'm not of it. I'm just in it. You feel me? The balance not mine. It's God's. And when you realize that all that anxiety and all that stress, pressure, boom, comes off, you'll learn to be more happier. All you got to know is God can be, if God is with you, he's going to be against you. Nobody. And when that devil, whenever, whenever something nigga, like Satan, get behind me, got to go, honey. Get behind me. Satan, get behind me. Mm -mm. Uh -uh, you're not bone in my bone. It's only flesh in my flesh. I'm proud of Jesus, bone in his bone, flesh his flesh. They say you resist the devil, flee, but you don't know what. I like to put it in different perspective. Ain't no devil. Sometimes our, our own devil, we are our own devils. We like to self, self, self up, self destruct ourselves by saying negative things and all this. Stop saying negative things about you. 
Don't you know you are created in the image of God? And when you talk about your brother, sister, you're talking about God's creation. And that really does piss him off. That's why Carmen's a bitch, not a bastard. Be careful what you say, because that's powerful. And powerful. This tongue is powerful. got death and life in it. Speak life and damn death. God said, why are you worried about the dead? You worried about the living. He got all, he got all in control. Live a great day. But that's what he going to do. Faith is itself. Faith is itself and not seen by hope for. When you ain't got faith in yourself, who's going to have faith in you? So we got to learn to stop doubting ourselves and doubting our brothers, honey. This 2023, God got a blessing with you and me. If you, got, if you don't have faith in yourself, how, how you going to ask God for anything? Get your ass up out of that bed. And no matter what you got to do, just get through it. But never give up. And know God got you. That's all I'm saying, y'all. You know? And that's spiritual aspect on, on 112. All the Bible, 66 scrolls, 7 scrolls, 1,000 scrolls, does not matter. God said, know that I saved you from a life, a life of uh, sin. Know that God loves you no matter what you do. Only man can judge you. I mean, only, only man can talk about you. Only God can judge you. And you'll create an image of him. Don't you know God got you? If he can make a, a net for a tree, and we can make um, a cave for a tiger. What you think he going to do with his own? He got all of us. But you got to stop putting yourself down. You'll create an image of God. And everything you go through, don't you think you create an image of God? That means that God like what you're doing? If it's good. Everything if, if everything that has been good, God did, God did it. Everything that's how everything been good, God did it. God did it. They got a song that I was trying to say. I don't remember the words. But good morning, Frosty. MGTV says, good morning, Steve. But Tismo says, uh, you just advanced a level level four. Uh, cool bot. Yeah, I'm fine. And, oh, God, we got Miss Antoine Lyons. Hello, Carolina. Hope you're feeling better. I am. You cooking rice for breakfast? Yes, Ashley, I'm cooking rice for breakfast. I, I go, got to go to the store. And I don't feel like it. You talking good, baby. I'm talking good because I know the word of God. He is good. God is good all the time. And all the time he's good. There's, matter of fact, good is an underestimate of how good God is. Really, he is. There is no 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 word to describe how beautiful he is. He's been better to us than we have our own selves. He woke you up this morning, started you on your right, and put you in your right mind. When God gives you a mind and woke you up this morning, it's up to you to decide this day going to be. Not up to him. He gave you today. So why are you going to waste valuable time doing something that you don't want to be doing? That's God say, go. One thing when you get there, y'all remember me sitting the 10 out. They sitting the 10 out and, and um, the seed. Who was going to spread the word of God? Who was thankful? Thankful for the word of God. Nine went on, but one came back and said, Lord, I just want to thank you. And now you know what that means. If God give you something, you better do something with it because he's going to ask you the day of judgment. What did you do when I gave you this day? What did you do that day? And you said, no, nah, I cussed out my neighbor, kicked my dog, shot somebody in the booty. You're going to get judged with all the things that you've done. You do more good, guess what? You eat what you sow. You eat good things. You do good things. You're going to do good, great things. You do bad things. Guess what? Boy, I don't hate to see you and the devil get a hold of your ass on judgment day. I'm going to pray for you. It's up to you to do good. So, Leo, let me uh, turn, stir this right. Stir it up. Stir it up. Yes, Ashley, I'm cooking rice. Rice, rice, rice. Rice for breakfast. Yeah, you know, we cook rice down here. We like shit. My daughter left some oatmeal up in here. But this country boy don't eat no damn no oatmeal. <laughs> yeah, he wants some grits, <laughs> grits and sugar. Now, me, I love oatmeal because I'm New York and country at the same time. So I'm more of a city slicker, but I would eat some oatmeal. Maybe, oh, yes, honey, but sugar my grits like my daughter. My daughter, youngest daughter, do that. My oldest daughter, now she like grits and salt and pepper from the dirty south. Kiki more like a, my youngest girl, she more like, how can you say a valley girl? Yes, mom. Like with those valley girls, like, oh. But that's like this. She a diva boss. Boom. <laughs> that's the difference in my kids. But they're the sweetest things in the world. I used to come home and be tired as hell, boy. Ash and Kiki. I can use Virginia. It'd be anywhere. Kiki, my young child, I mean, I got in my daughter Ashley's shoes. Oh, yeah, this World War Three. I will come home and get my corona clothes. I said, y'all can fight all you want to be the first person to pass a leak when mom coming out both of y'all asses. Ashley would be like, girl, I don't told you about any of your stuff. I'm not your, I'm not your, what she said, I'm not your friend. I'll, I'll slap the fire you or something. But anyway, I would sit back 
And they be fussing about the shoes, fussing about doing sisters. You know how sisters are. But they love each other to death, though. They really do. Yeah, Ashley helped pretty much raise my daughter Kiki when I go deploy to whatever, you know. My daughter, she's my backbone. She's my oldest. And, you know, I always like, look at you take care of your sister. But we, we, you and you, me, you and her is all we got. I'm going to take care of you. You take care of her. And Kiki going to turn. It's like a, a circle, love circle. Mama got you, but you got to watch over your sister while I'm gone. Because anything go wrong, I'm going to blame Ashley for it. She know what. But I guess when I'm going, Ashley to start whooping Kiki ass. <laughs> and now Kiki give Ashley respect. Y'all know it's a picking order when you're the oldest. Leave home. Your mama like, anything happen, I'm getting the oldest. I'm getting everybody. Shit, my brother and sister act up. I know I'm going to get my ass. I'm going to fucking just come and F them up. I'll get my ass well. They're going to get their ass well. I'm going I'm to fire that ass up. And that's why my brothers and sisters respect me to this day. But we have our quarters. Don't get me wrong. We ain't going to throw no blows in there. But shit, I learned how to be a black belt. My brother loved wrestling. We used to beat our little sister up. Though. We used to slang her to the wall, put the pick and fall on her ass. And she liked it. Then she was come back and try to fight. Yeah, that's how she learned how to fight. Me and my brother learned my little sister how to fight. And it, Keisha learned Erica how to fight. Me and Lamont, we don't fight. Me and Keisha, we'll fight in a minute. Erica and I don't fight. Keisha and Erica, sometimes they fight. Ashley and Earl gonna get in a fight. We all been in fights. But I ain't losing no fight. I'm the oldest. I ain't supposed to. And I ain't get my ass whooped for no brother, no sister. <laughs> Just saying, y'all. I'm waiting for this rice, y'all. And then we're gonna do the cheese and eggs. Do the breakfast thing. And it is what it is. You guys like and share me out. Please go ahead and hit that like button if you have not done that. And uh I don't know, y'all. It's gonna I'm gonna be live pretty much all day. Yeah, but anyway, I'm gonna take down this tree. I am. I got to, y'all. That tree got to calm down, even though I don't want to. I think I'm gonna do slide that bastard in the back. <laughs> no, I ain't gonna do that. I'm gonna actually take out. No, I'm gonna slide in the back. I don't know. We'll see. Because it's a pre lit tree. Please believe me, Antoine. I hope you, uh, Antoine Lance. I hope you're doing better. Yes, I am doing better. Thank you. And you just advanced to level four. Yeah, one hour, two minutes, and eight seconds, y'all. I was trying to have it done an hour, but I guess I got a little happy. Because my hair show ain't there, but my daughter gonna take his hat off. So, but I tell you what, I am not gonna take down the Christmas tree. I don't think I'll take down the Christmas tree tonight. How about that? When we have that open panel, I want to know how Tree Lynn T is doing. I, mean, I seen Tree Lynn T went live, and uh, I need a call. I got her number. But anyway, um, I want to do a, a VIP panel tonight. That's what we're gonna have a VIP panel stream, y'all. You want to come on up? Come on up. You know, just click on the link. But I'll be on stream y'all with open Facebook or excuse me, open YouTube, but YouTube be on mute. I'll be looking at my comments on StreamYard. And if you don't know how to do StreamYard, I can walk you through it, show you how to do it and all that. Yeah. But the time right now is 1052. 1032. So once again, when I have breakfast, we have brunch. Y'all was cold this morning. Shit. I was cold. It's still cold. The temperature right now is, let me tell you. Y'all never gave myself a thumbs up. Look at my phone. It's fifty percent dead. I bet my daughter probably trying to call me. Mom, I'm trying to call your phone off. We're charging. Yeah, uh, I'm waiting for my youngest daughter to call me. I thought she would call me home today. I'm coming through, but I don't know. My daughters, they, my daughters' careers, they're always working. Working all the time. You cooking rice for breakfast? Yes, yes, I'm cooking rice for breakfast. If y'all want to donate to the channel, you can. Let me put my um my uh cash app in there because honey, all donations are great, especially so others may eat places I like to dedicate money to because you know it's about the holidays of the department those with disabled American veterans and also like the uh so other may eat in Washington, DC, and also to the college fund. And one other thing I like to contribute to is uh disabled American veterans. So if you like to contribute to the channel, my cash app is going to be and sometimes go back to y'all cash out. Our cash app is going to be Carolina Diamond. I'm going to put in pin it to the comments at the top. Carol. Dang. I'm going to it. I don't care if it's changed. Like make it jingle. Make it fold. No no donation too big or too too small. We take them all. Because, you know, when you're trying to do great things, it it, it can't. It, look, everything in life costs. Even the air we breathe sometimes. But salvation is free, thus says the Lord. So if you want to contribute to the channel, there is my link. 
Uh, I greatly appreciate you if you give a love donation to Carolina Diamond Productions. It goes to the food, it goes back up in a lot of charities, and most of it goes back to y'all super chats. So if I come in and you don't see no super chat, that means I ain't got no cash, I have money, baby. I ain't got no cheeseburger money, honey. <laughs> there we go. Yes, Lord. Well, y'all, that rice is smelling good, good, good. I'm going to do is put some toast in the toaster, do the cheese and eggs and rice. And I'm going to make his plate. Sit down and keep talking. Antoine, and what are you guys doing? What are y'all plans? Ashley, what you doing today? Beautiful. What are you doing today, daughter? Yeah, the tip is right now. As soon as I turn my phone, I'll tell you what it is. I was going to go walking. Hey, what's up, Tree Lynn? We'll just talk about you, beautiful. How you doing? Hope all is well. Much love, darling. My daughter Kiki saw your paintings. She liked your videos. Yeah, I'm gonna show you. I'll show you. I'm gonna show you all her paintings right now. Now I gotta go get some friends. Yeah. Now my oldest daughter, my youngest daughter Kiki. Trillian, the rest of them. I'll show you all of them. I got three of them. I don't know if you've seen them. This is uh, my baby Kiki. She in the painting. This is another. I love this one because you know I love I love the stars and the moons for some reason. I guess the Nostradamus. Ain't that nice? And I like how she. It's, it feels rough too. I don't know what kind of paper is. It. I'm gonna start trying to paint myself. Stick people. Look at the eye in the sky. Boom. My daughter. She's into this thing called Nostradamus. She loves predictions and numbers and shit. Me, I don't want her watching that because I don't. I know. I tell her, no man know the come of God. She's like, Mom, signs and wonders. I be like, yeah, your daddy right, but your daddy ain't hitting it on the head. Her dad a preacher. And then I'll come back with Bible verses. Damn, she's good. Yeah, she's yeah, she's pretty damn good. Hell yeah. <laughs> you damn right she's good. She's lying. <laughs> well, anyway, I'm going to clap on my kids, baby. They are very educated. And we got Lady J up in here, uh, Tree Lynn T. She's my oldest. The one you see so pretty. Somebody happy New Year's and, you know, mm, Miss... Tyra Banks herself. <laughs> Lady J up in there. She, I love, I love my kids. She was last one. I'm like, you cooking rice for breakfast? Hell yeah. I ain't going to get no grits. It's cold. Yeah. But I actually know how my mom is. If I ain't got no grits, I'm cooking rice. Yeah, and then what I can do with my extra rice is this. I'm going to cook me some salmon pads, some amazing rice, Ashley. Your favorite dish. Tonight. I'm going to cook some fresh rice. I ain't cook enough rice with it last. It's just another substitute grits. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, my phone. I'm ready to eat, y'all. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry, hungry, hungry. Yeah, um, you know, to start, a, a start cleaning your body, you got to eat right for 2023. I try to eat right every day, possibly. But some days I do cheat, honey. Like that chocolate cake. And my daughter and I love candy. Hell, yeah, I eat candy out of the ass. Mom used to call me cake and not candy. You just open your eyes. Oh, well, we had a, um, we slept good last night. Y'all, it's 35 damn degrees right here. Excuse me, Lord. Look at 35. And y'all know I ain't going nowhere. All Christ. Wait a minute. That's at four o'clock this morning. Go up. Hope you won't. Shit. Oh, now it's 46. But still a little cool, chilly, but it ain't cold. No, me and Soja, I get cold. It's like 20 degrees. I go outside now, barefoot, no damn shoes on. Probably I'm still sick. My daughter like, Mom, you going outside bear for the fuck? Yeah, shit. I'm New York country girl. Boom, I'm in the country. What a stop sign don't say stop. They say, whoa. Ain't no sense, brother, in my yard. I used to ask when I was a little kid. You know what I used to do most of my time? Flip. They going to be the next Nadia Kavanichi. Yeah, yeah. My granddad gives that girl. All she do is flip right here. She going to have a baby before she turn 15. Damn, he didn't tell the truth. Yeah, I had my daughter actually at 15. Uh-huh. Auntie Mom, what's going on? Hey, baby, I didn't know you were going live. I told you I'm going to go live in my Santa Claus suit. Take down that cursor tree, but you know what I'm doing to Mama. Push that shit in the back. <laughs> oh, boy, my grandson came home from the Christmas. With a, with Christmas. He know all them ball rules. I said, go on, boy, jingle langer. Jingle langer. <laughs> Auntie Mom, we got Lady J. Ash, my, my oldest daughter in here. She's Lady J. She's my master, my, my fashion. Fashion is my dominator. When I can tell my, take that hat off your head, mama. <laughs> she like Quay to you. It's Ashley, though. Ashley Cole. 
Lady J. But she don't like to be putting on blast like that. Love my nails. Thank you, baby. I got to do them. You see right here. My auntie mom go, smoke guns. <laughs> we got to get the trigger finger in the, in the thumb done. I don't know. I'm going to switch up to another color. I do my own nails at home, though. I really do. That's money saving my grandkids' college fund, child. I can cut back a lot for the new year. He said, don't push me. And now graduate from school, Ashley. Oh, Ashley Cole. Love. Never knew what I've been missing. Oh, Lord. I'm thinking about Keisha Cole when you say Keisha. I mean, Ashley Cole. And she got a new name. Not Nicole, but Cole. Yes. Like Natalie Cole. Nat King Cole. Old King Cole was a merry old soul. And a merry old soul was he. Uh-huh. <laughs> Call for his wife. Call for his boat. And call for the mighty three. Uh-huh. Okay, I just remember I was having a bad dream. What bad dream is that? Come on, Tamar, we got to pop a size, honey. Got to bring God up in the building. God said one or two in the midst. He is there. Boom, shaka lock. You got my ass in the cold, little him. She's cancer, baby. And she got God in so much in her. She got to tell me, quit talking to tone sometimes. Mom, I don't got to talk, uh, speak tone to talk to Jesus. You're right. You're right. She said, Mom, you supposed to put that in your bedroom. Not in here, Mom. <laughs> Well, under my kids used to piss me off. Please, the blood of Jesus. You know, I ain't going to say it like that now because, you know, I have learned to get the tone. My daughter's like, oh, God, my mom going fucking crazy. No, baby. Mom got to get the tone. Mom, I don't got to talk. I don't got to speak to you know, Jesus. No, you don't. No, you don't. That's what God said. Go to your private chamber. Yes. I need to wake up. Talk to you later. Truth, Lee, you finna go? Well, okay, baby. Have a blessed day. Have a blessed day, darling. But anyway, let me go and stir it up. Get me a cup. I got my cup on to mom. I got to stir the rice up. My daughter said, Mom, you going to cook rice? Yeah, I'm cooking rice. I ain't going no damn well. Hell, it's cold out there. Piggy wiggy shit. See him at 1 o'clock. No, it's a 46 degrees. My daughter said, I'm still in my pajamas. Put a Santa Claus, Santa Claus suit on. And she going to say, Mama, take out that hand. Shit, I'm sporting this hat, girl. You know how much I pay for this shit? Over $40. Hey, one more. Rock it. <laughs> we wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. You see, 2023. Happy 23, y'all. Y'all, let me set this right, y'all. Get you a cup. Y'all, and the rice is done. Yeah, y'all look at that rice. Oh, shoot. One of my jingle bells just fell out my damn suit. <laughs> look at that rice, y'all. Nice and smooth. What I'm going to do is wash the starch off and put it in a, another pot, which is a drainer. Yes, yes, yes. And sometimes, y'all, you know what I do? I just take a plate and drain it. The last thing that this contract yep. states is right. to me. Can't, can't, can't believe it's not butter is what kind of margin I'm using, y'all. Cannot believe it's butter. 50% you know, less fat, 50% you know, less of them oils that give you that, that uh clog up your heart. That's what I'm not talking about. Because Uncle Daddy got to watch his figure too, and so does Mama Boy. You got high cholesterol, so we got to make sure our men stay strong so they can be around. So we got somebody cuss, they'll cuss out when we get pissed off. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just wondering. I don't cuss him out unless he do something stupid. It's almost every day, Mama's boy doing something stupid. But we got love by men, though. We got love by men. So they the head, y'all. Not the table. We come with neighbors, so we supposed to be their helpmates. So we got to help you. Help me cold little children. But me, I'm going to tell you, my grandma said, a man ain't good with two things. Poking and pissing. <laughs> I miss my grandma ball. Rest in peace, Aunt Ball of Kirby. She's talking about me somewhere, y'all. That, that tell you, my granddaughter mine is a trip, but I love Poking and pissing. Just like a dog. Poking and pissing. It's all men poke and piss. They do. Poke, piss. Poke, piss. We stop, eat, repeat again. Poke, piss. Poke, piss. Y'all know what happened, brother. You gotta lift our brothers up. You wanna punish people? We're actually liking professional wrestling guys like Colt Cabana, guys like Luke Gallows. Yeah, I'm about to go ahead and put this cheese in there. I know you're hungry. For them, because they can't be here right now, and they can't stand up to you, and they can't let 
Oh, Alright, I'm gonna show you what uh, mama's mama's aunt's mama show you what mama boy doing. See, you always make a South Vegas. You know, you gotta argue with your man or your your, your friend, whoever y'all wanna call the people y'all with. You just let a man do his thing. But watch what happened. Let me show you how the hard head make a South Vegas. On the chair. Okay, let's just on the chair, Auntie Mommy. You see, on the chair. Just calm down. On the chair. Hurting, but on the chair. Stoning. I had six months already this morning. Well, if they keep him on the chair, at least now we done. Anyway, I'm stirring it up, y'all. Put a little salt and um salt and uh pepper into my rice. Sign the contract and apologize and spare your company. <laughs> but it could be cheese and eggs, but I'm turn around y'all can see me. Hold up. <laughs> let's just get this over with, okay? And, and I mean, let's just, you know, look, I, come on, I, I've eaten a crap sandwich out here. Hold on just a second, y'all. I'm about to turn around. Y'all can see me. You can watch this special. I need to put my cheese in there. Uh, I got this one. Put this cheese in there. Good morning. I'm about to turn around, y'all. Hold up. Sorry. Nope. I'm sorry. Let me swing y'all my way. Swing y'all my way. Well, y'all can see what I'm doing. See, look at it. Here we go. We got to have no tripod and no laptop. Let's swing that bass around, Jason. <laughs> so right now, I'm going to give me some olive oil. Put like a one-third cup of oil in the base of your spatula, whatever you're using. I love the yolk. Don't use like my my grill iron spatula, but not today. Uh, Cause ain't, ain't that many people here with eating no eggs with me and cheese. He said, "Watch the rest. That's all you do. Get high and watch the rest." It's about that much, y'all see? Just enough to oil it. But like, you remember that Pam you spray? You don't need all that extra oil. Just a little bit. So what we do now, y'all? I'm gonna put this on a low medium. Go use the restroom. Take my water. Go wash my hands. And be right back. I'm back, y'all. Y'all finna see me. I'll tell you what, let's just take care of this right now. Y'all come on over here with me. I can see what I'm doing. There we go. What I'm about to do, y'all, now is take this cup, put about one third of milk in it, and four eggs, and boom, you're gonna start eating breakfast. Oh, God. Take my cheese board out. Okay. Sorry about this, it's a joke, y'all. So, okay, I'm gonna read the chair just a minute. Y'all give me a minute. I'm gonna do these eggs right quick and finish up breakfast. So, the plate down and give me a cup of. I'm gonna give me another cup of coffee. I don't think I'm gonna give him some Mountain Dew. I wanna make sure he eats because he's, he's, he's not feeling well, y'all. We gotta keep our men strong. 
by feeding them adequate food. He went to McDonald's, y'all. Give him something. He said the egg and cheese and that's still the work. I'm home and feeling weak. Please cook me seven. I said, yeah, why cook you seven? I got up out of my bed when I could have just sat there and watched YouTube and cook this boy seven. I'm gonna cook him enough cheese near that he going he gonna eat and shit and go to sleep. Repeat again, right? Eat and sleep, eat sleep. Why does that a wrong a brock brothers on his eat, sleep, repeat? Eat, sleep, repeat. Yeah. Oh God, I hate that. Y'all, you go get eggs from Piggly Wiggly or whatever the case may be, food line, etc. Whatever grocery store you go to. The egg be sat there and uh Probably because it partially cracked. People pick them up and see the eggs go turn them around and they crack. And look, and they stay inside the uh the egg carton. I hate that. And you got to throw the whole damn egg away. Cause I'm not messing up the egg and can't crack. That's what someone else is sitting in and all that. Y'all, my, my mom was a USD inspector. She teaches me all this stuff when I was a little girl. I took a test for so she can go to the USD right before I was going to college. She's like, my daughter's smart. She take a test for me. I gotta tell my daughter, ask to do my homework. Now, mama, I don't think you want me to do this. <laughs> Cause I used to get on my daughter's about cheating all the time in school. So when they tell me that, I'm like, all right, guess that ain't gonna work right now. I, I was told my daughter, as I pay you to do my college homework. No, mom, you do. But anyway, so much for that. So what I'm gonna do now, guys, is uh. You will ask these folks to be the voice of the voiceless. Make sure that my grease is good. I'm going to check on the seven because I want to really, really uh, pop these eggs. Now I got the milk in there. I got my yolk. What I'm going to do is pop four of my yolks. One, two, three, four. So all you doing when I say pop is stick the, 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 the fork in it. And what it does make all that yellow. You can you can see it. All that yellow come out. You just stir it up. Like I'm talking about stir it up. Get you a cup. Well, stir them eggs up in that cup. Should it all become white, just like you want to bake a cake. I say about 50, 50, 50 circular, 50 times this way. And this, you all know when it's right. So what I'm going to do now, right now, is go ahead and y'all turn y'all back around again. Can y'all see me? Go ahead and just pour it up in there. But in the path of doing things you want to do, and then I got my cheese board, y'all. Italian cheese. I got this from um, Walmart. I always did. I got my Parmesan cheese. I got my Fanita. I got my Parmesan cheese, and I got my Azigo cheese. Azigo is sweet and nutty, and uh, Parmesan cheese, you know, is rich and flavored. Um, and my Fontina cheese is mild and buttery, and my, I got my mild and satisfying. So I'm gonna put me some Parmesan cheese in it. Italian cheese, you know, what it makes it rich. But all these cheeses will do. But a lot of people don't break down cheese the way I do. I love cheese. I love cheese so much I don't know how to break it all the way down. And some of y'all good cooks do too. But how much cheese? What kind of cheese? What kind of cheese you want on your Philly, your Philly stick of cheese? I want me some cheddar cheese on mine. Cheese make a big difference in your food, y'all. Now what kind of cheese you got? You can look it up, Google it, whatever. Do what you do. But I know I like my food. I'm not going to be standing out there. You. So I'm gonna turn this up a little bit because I wanted to just basically form a base. You ain't got to sit there and stir cheese and eggs up so much. You let it form a base, and then after that, it should be good. So I'm gonna get me two more slices because I don't need all that extra cheese just to make it a cheesy egg. And with a uh, cheese board, you don't have to slice them up. You can just take them in your fingers and crumble cr 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 it up. Give it that, that shredded cheese effect. And I take it and I put it all over my cheese. And I let it form like it's going to be an omelet. And then I'll take my spatula and go ahead and scramble it up. And then I'll let it be time to eat. And with that being said, y'all, it's forming pretty good. I'm going to take it out the high and put it on the low seven, simmer, high seven simmer. While right, that's going on, I'm going to go ahead and put my toast in the dog on toast. Because that's how long it's going to take me to make this boy put it in we got to keep him strong, man. One thing I can't stand is a 60-year-old guy on a chair sick because he ain't eating. Here's what you lost sight of, John, and I'm really happy that your father and your wife are sitting in my front row. Any bread would do. Three thumbs, two people done, 13 thumbs up. Y'all going to smash that like button. I don't like number 13. I like the sevens. Somebody make me a 14. And the Powerball number, make was 13. My mama's birthday, June 13th. Ladies and gentlemen, the champ is here. You, like the rest Let's see, two What I'm gonna do now, y'all? Put a little bit of salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. 
New yeah, I'm not good. Uh, salt York, and pepper. The New York Yankees. It's your thing. Do what you want to do. I can't tell you who to suck it to. Red Sub ain't saying that one, but uh, Salt and Pepper got a little rap thing. They had came out 1991. Right, boy, Roxanne, Roxanne. Y'all remember where the world were? Seven, 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 ninety-three, eleven. Who's baby? Please, can I call tonight? I wonder what happened to that group ready for the world. What they had them Jerry curls? What they look like? The new temptations. Well, anyway, y'all, my egg has formed into a big old giant omelet. So what we do now is take cut and dice it up because that weight added up too high. I could put it in a big old oven, but I don't want to do that. Like, well, I'm gonna scramble this shit up, right? And scramble it up, cut it down, cut the eggs up since I let it get so big. Cause normally you can take a fork or spread and just do it that way. But this is faster than me. Uh, the toast ain't dark enough, man. So I'm gonna for a little bit more longer. Yes, Lord. This one's gonna oh so good. Mm. Oh, how about burn myself, y'all? God dang it. I'm just so I turned the special down on six instead of seven. So ladies and gentlemen of the WWE. Hey, look at that cheese. Oh, that cheese. I'm just fine, y'all. I'm mighty fine, mighty fine, mighty fine. Uh, Andy Graves said, mmm, mmm. Ooh, boy, that's good. Him and over eating I ain't beat stuff on Andy Griffin. Say goodbye to John Cena. I, and I like Barney Five. Nip it in the bud. Y'all remember the other one? Uh, the one that liked Romino. Ernest T. Bags. <laughs> So I had a song about Ernest C. Bears. Yes. Wild thing. Did he say something about, about uh a song about Ernest T. Bears? Somebody did. It made him a lot of money too. But everybody down here, we love this man group. Y'all, that's already done. So what I'm gonna do right to put that to the side. Get this boy play because it's time to eat, eat, eat. And y'all, if anybody say anything in the chat, I'm gonna let y'all go. And uh, hope y'all enjoy y'all happy Saturday. But um, I'm going to make this play first. So it's going to be about at least good five, ten minutes before I go up there. So, toast. Oh, I'm not going to finish this on, but I'm going to show y'all what it looks like, though. But since he's sick, I, I'll bait him a little bit. I got to turn the stove off. Y'all, I'm bad about it. When I cook, sometimes I'll be like, damn, I left the stove on. So I'm going to put a little bit on his plate here. Not too much, because I don't know how his stomach feels. His stomach's going to upset. I was medication to drop him. All right. Put that to the side. And yes, as we eat rice this morning. Many months, Mama cooked you rice. You ate it. <laughs> Man, that's like rice and ketchup in my, my shit. I ain't lying. My grandma bought her sister, Miss Lexi Reed. Uh, Miss Lexi Reed. Um, started with she put, she put ketchup and everything. I put ketchup in my I get it from her. Ketchup, ketchup, ketchup. I'm going to get a couple strips of this bacon for him. Somebody call my mom. Mm. Man, I'm sitting, sitting egg flaming. Give me some rice. Not too much. I'm gonna see how he gonna eat that. I'm gonna get my cup and put some hands. Look here. He like to drink out of Aiden's cup. My grandson. He always do it. He love my grandson Aiden. He calls him his grandbaby, even though it's not his granddad. But everybody. His my um running Myers, I call him Mama's boy, Stoner boy, but his nickname is Cheese. And my grandkids call him Cheese. Say cheese, Gamma, say cheese. To Myron and Aiden. And he just loves Aiden to death. I mean, really. Running has an older son, but you know, he called Aiden his baby. He loves Aiden. He said, I wish I could come home and watch uh Jack Harmon. E I E O. Y'all yeah, I mean, I was in Virginia when Cheese was sitting there with my grandson, Josiah Little. I love my baby. I love both of them. And when Josiah leave, I'll say Asia Hartman. Sing that Hartman song all the time. Butterfly, old McDaniel had a form. That type of stuff. Oh, 
I'm gonna give him some Mountain Dew, y'all. I'm gonna sit my booty down. How about that? No, for some reason, I am not hungry. I guess because I've been living, and then I'm trying to get my appetite. Coffee, coffee suppresses uh, hungerness. You know that? And I think it's going on, but I'm gonna put me some in my stomach. I'm like, I got the, you know, you gotta feed the cold, starve the flu. I ain't got the flu. I got a cold now. Time, you ready? Come on, what time is it? You smell the brick with shit. Don't let that step boy fool you. Mama's boy, no, he's very smart. He's like, I'm gonna keep waiting this girl cook. Wait a minute, here it is, y'all. Let me show you what the meal looks like. So you been to eat? Ain't you ready? 10 30. Yeah, we got the bacon, cheese and eggs, rice, and toast. Now, we're going to take it to him. Take it to him. Y'all going to see him come back. He's going to put some more salt on the food. Oh, let me give him a fork. Let me give him a utensil. Okay. I'm going to fix me up. I'm going to sit down. Here, Ryan. Here, Ryan. Here, Ryan. Right up. Huh? You don't want to eat that. You don't want to You don't want to eat that. You don't want to eat that. You don't want to eat that. You Oh, wow. I did that gallstone, man. If you ain't feeling no pain, are you? No. Y'all, I'm going to fix his own plate. He, don't, he said he don't have an appetite. He'll come and get his own plate, but guess what? This plate for me. How about this? Ain't no shame in my game. He wants a cold soda? He don't feel good, y'all. I think maybe uh, if he don't feel no better, we're going to take him to the emergency room. I'm still here, and you know we always going to make them a plate. Yeah, but he don't feel like he's going to come make his own plate. He's going to eat like a, you know, get him a little sauce and try to eat a little bit of stomach upset. So that would happen when you hard hit him with a soft ass on that bunch of mom. Running around here, and it's cold, getting up early in the morning, knowing he should be in the house and not feeling good. But anyway, that's a man for you. You know, a man going to do what they going to do. Let me go and read this chat, y'all, before I stop. I need to plug this thing up, y'all. Hold up. Plug it up. I'm going to read these comments when Auntie Mama first came in. Let me plug this thing up. Yeah, anyway, y'all. I, I I cook for me, really. And extras, people want to eat, they eat it. Not oh well. Hell, more left. That was what? At lunchtime, 1 o'clock. Because y'all know I don't cook for one time a day. I might cook me some salmon pepper and all that. I'm just cooking for me. So if you want to eat, eat. Don't eat, don't. But anyway, it says good morning, um, MFTWG, which is uh, motivational weightlifting geek. See, good morning, your channel. Good morning, Steve. I done read all that, y'all. I uh, got boots on. Good morning, Steve. So this is nice to meet you, Steve Gilmore. Dropping down his link. See, uh, Gilmore YouTube. Boy, I'm so glad you got your 1K, bro. Salute. And I see that you're doing marvelous things about doing the Bible. So that's something we always need. A lot of my friends are doing that, turning to the Bible. My, my mama talked, and I talked about this. More people turning to more to God now than they ever have in their life. I said, yeah, yeah, there's signs and wonders. But anyway, um, Steve Gilmore saying, prayers, Holy Ghost, to be God be the glory. Yes, sir, to God be the glory, because the glory is God. And we and may, we may do it for one night, but joy comes in the morning. Testify, brother. You better go and testify. And then the auntie mama came up in here and said, boom, shakalaka. And as said, you cooking rice, and he said, you talking good. Of course I am, Antoine Lyons. You know what we do. Tree Lens is morning, sis. Tree Lens is, oh, cool. Tree Lens is, wow, damn, she's good. Yeah, my daughter in her pain. Yeah, she's pretty good. I just opened my eyes. She's saying she don't feel good. Auntie Mama says, hey, babe, I didn't know you was live. Yeah, I'm live. Tree Lens is, auntie, throwing out some love. Auntie Mama said, ha, ha, love the nails. Thank you, Tree Lens. Salute. And Auntie Mama speaking to my daughter. Say hello, Ask the Cole. Love, never knew what I was missing. I love that song. Yes, okay. I just remember it was she was having a bad dream. I need to wake up. Talk to you later. Oh shit, she was having a bad dream. I'll be all right, Tree Lynn. I said, Mama laughing. 
Oh shit. Uncle Daddy said, you run him of uh, my best friend, your cousin. Oh, really? Okay, that's what's up. Get on up. Get you a cup, Auntie Mama. I love your Santa Claus. Thank you, darling. Thank you so much. Tell that shit to Ashley. She said she like it, Ashley. <laughs> hey, Agent Gray. Hey, hey, uh, Agent Gray, you coming from my brother's channel? I'm a part of his uh, one of his mods over there at Bandit Boys doing the damn thing. Welcome to the chat. Love you so much. I'm sure Bandit Boys must have sent you over here, Corey Bradford. Yes, yes, yes. Prince Daniel will not write. Hey, wait a minute. Let me see something. Yo, let me show y'all how to know your mods. I'm going to show this message. It better be Prince Daniel, too. Prince Daniel is always in the blue. If it's not blue, then I know it's uh, Avram, the snake boys. So is, is, is Prince Daniel in the blue? <laughs> Hold on, y'all. Before I get upset, let me give me some food so I can hush my mouth. <laughs> Prince Daniel, this is not Prince Daniel. No, it ain't. But Batismo agent says, you see Corey Bradford, take him, take him out, take him off the check. Oh, yeah. I would definitely will, honey. Agent Greg, you know, I already know who I am. Can't love no damn camera. I'm told that boy. <laughs> I'm talking about. You just put the toast in the oven. No, I put the toast in the damn toaster, honey. I believe we're cooking fast and quick, so I can enjoy more time talking to y'all. Besides, he's sick. He's going he to get a pop-up. That's what happens. You can't have a foot in your mama house and foot in your uh, ex-girlfriend house. You got to choose one. That's what's getting cold outside. Running around, think he's Superman. Now he's crypt. Superman and took his kryptonite from his ass. Now he's oh, hard-headed. Me and hard-headed. You can't tell him shit. Me and I ain't going to tell him shit. He got a mama. The mama's boy. You see Corey Bradford take him down out of the chat. I will, Agent Gray. Hey, Agent Gray, drop your link, baby, because I'm about to make you blue. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Welcome to the stream, Agent Gray. He's now a moderator. That's what's up. Yeah, I'm trying to eat. I'm hungry. And this shit is the bomb. My dog know I can cook. But he don't feel good. I don't see anybody sleep. Yeah, this was so good. So good, I want to go kiss my mom. <laughs> I'm to mama and my mama. Yes. Mm. Yeah, I'm tired of drinking coffee. I'm drinking some soda now. About to read the chat, y'all. Give me a minute. Mm. I got to eat, honey. This is the hunger. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. About to read it again. <laughs> Let me get some more of this cheese and eggs, honey. Put that Provona cheese on it. It's like, ooh, you know, Provona cheese is the kind you put on your steak sub. Your steak sub. The Italian cheese. Mm. Rich and buttery and flavory. I love it. Mm. All right, let me read it now. Welcome to the stream, Agent Grave and Batissimo. You got my Benny Boys, his channel name. Yes, I know Corey. Corey's a good friend of mine. Prince Daniel up in the house. Let me show this message because I'm trying to see it. Mm, come on in. I'm lucky to see this girl with a small dick show there for us. But you know what? Get up out of here. Prince Daniel would never say no shit like that. You know what? Uh uh, bye. That's why you gotta know your minds, y'all. Gotta know them. Prince Daniel would never talk like that. Prince Daniel, drink all women respect. See, I'm back, just finished the morning live. You did, Nate. Dang, I gotta check you out when I get out here. I just let me see that. People gonna try to pretend they Prince Daniel. Prince Daniel would never talk like that. It's the snake boys. Come on in, come through. It's the viewers, we but get what. You better come correct, cause I'm, my mind's gonna get you. I'm gonna get you one. We ain't got time for that drum in here. My daughter in here too. You gonna respect the ladies or get booted in the hell out? Smoke a gun. <laughs> Auntie Mama listening must be doing something right now. Cause Auntie Mama got his ass. 
Ashley must be doing something. She damn sure would have got him too. Zai, you gonna talk dirty? At least know how to spell it. <laughs> well, who in the building with me? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and eat this breakfast. Who is in the building with me? Auntie Mommy and hey, uh, Nate, the great podcast. Yeah, but um, yeah, y'all. Um, we gotta get mommy boy feeling good. I think I smoke too much dope. <laughs> Marijuana. Smoking too much weed ain't good for nobody. Yep. Besides, he told me when he came in, I told me, yeah, I got this stuff in your cousin. Somebody, it's called sit down. I bet you go sit down. And that was wrong. I'm gonna tell you right now, I know exactly what's going on. When you smoke weed, three effects. You're happy, hungry, sleeping. Yeah, I already ate some of it. I know it went and got him something else to eat. Now he's sleeping. Give him about an hour. He'll be a hubby baba. Anyway, y'all. 46 degrees at 1038. Um, one person in the building. I thank you. Uh, my other friend just came through. Just made my mod. from Corey Bradford. Mm. But anyway, I'm about to jump off here, y'all. I'm gonna come back on at seven o'clock. What we do a stream, y'all. I'm gonna make this 15 minutes, make, make this two hour live stream after that. Hope you guys have a happy sensational Saturday. And uh, just come on through, like, share me out. I'll be here for another 15 more minutes. I'm well, actually, another 19 minutes for a two hour live stream. And um, I was hoping more people come to do I was gonna do a channel review, but um. Uh, it's still early. People are still in the bed. It's cold. Yeah, I'm going to go back and see what Corey Bradford is doing. I may play a game with him. Let me see. I'm going to call my buddy. Jesus is a freak. What is the national time in um, Canada? Yeah, it's 11, 18, 8 in the morning, ain't it? What time is it in Canada right now? That means I'm the same thing as us. That's a known day. This is one was crossing the border of New York. I love Ontario, Canada. I want to go up there so bad. Let me see what Jesus freaked on. Hi, buddy. <laughs> I wish I could get him on the phone, you know. Let me see, you going live tonight, did they? We're supposed to collaborate, that's what I'm calling. Hey, buddy. He ain't answering. He pop out. No one ain't no telling where his ass at. Well, anyway. So call me back. Text me back. Well, y'all breakfast is good. It really is. Um, let me uh, look at myself and get myself I'm like, damn. I'm on my phone. I'm trying to see if I got any messages. No, not from anybody. Somebody said they lied. Who lied? Who, know, who is this? Oh, uh, Miss Lopez. I thought I was live at one o'clock this morning. <laughs> anyway, a special shout out to Joni's journey. Y'all remember her? The one that she um basically make this nice. This nice, uh, nice crafts and whatever she's got it going on. Until mommy, you're in the business, you're in the building. She, she can, she definitely, definitely can make um some good crafts. Prince Daniel, you know what? Maybe let me go look back at that again. I'm about to verify. Maybe I have my glasses on. Mm. And we'll get in around two or three in the morning and it's you deleted messages. 
like our clients want to have. Because it will come in and work out after the show. Is that really Prince Daniel? Right. I don't know, honey. This man is in his 70s and he's working out hard. He's a meathead. Okay, let me read it. This is insane. At Trillian T. Hell, mm, watching a webcam girl with a, a drink, stroking it, love, love, love it. No, nah, Prince Dan, I see why, I see why uh, Brooklyn, so why she had to go. That ain't, that's not um Prince Daniel, not the real Prince Daniel. Somebody pretend he is. But anyway, y'all, I'm going to go let y'all enjoy y'all day. Because ain't nobody talking about anything, so I hate to be boring right now. So I got a couple of things I need to do. I may go live later. I don't know. If anybody in the building is talking to me right now at the end of this chat, I will. But no, that's not Prince Daniel. And Trina, I want to apologize to you, my sister. So who's in the house? Is that you, Nate, the great podcast? I don't know. Maybe somebody listening to me. Maybe I'm to mom. I don't know. Maybe my daughter. The world was once again. But anyway, I'm giving myself a light. I'm going to make this a two hour live stream. So I might as well finish my breakfast. Yeah, I'm giving myself a like. I can tell who was in the chat. Wait a minute. You know, go back to the top, get hit the three, bu three buttons at the top. Participants. And the person that's here is just me, Carolina Diamond. That's it. So, um, chat. What I'm going to do is finish eating, clip the kitchen, y'all. And you got to think of the city in the chat. I've got to get my watch time, so I'll make this even two hours. Two people in the building, 13 thumbs up. I'm talking about he even want to eat. I hope nobody hear me. You hear me, Miss Fine, because I know we family, whoever it is. All my mom, my sister, whoever made the case. But the reason why that boy is not eating is because he's too damn high. Smoke too much river. He need to lay low. Doctor to told him that too. Stop smoking so much weed. He wonder why he getting nervous. Your body can't take all that weed, boy. Damn, nine bucks a day. What the fuck? I got that good stuff in Ridge. <clears throat> Somebody make me want to do nothing. Just lay around and sleep. I said, motherfucker, you too high. I was like, we can't talk like this. You smoke too much weed. I, I can't stand it. I understand you do it, you know, two pulls or a blunt a day, but hell no, you do nine blunts, ten blunts, you ain't good to nobody, not even yourself, but lay on the chair. And I just be damn, he gonna wear my chair. I send his ass on this mama. I call him mama, boy. Mm -mm. You don't bring your ass over to sleep in my house. Uh -uh. We ain't rolling like that. We just good friends. Yeah. Caroline Diamond trying to get in there. So some new new dude. <laughs> no, I'm taking my time. But when it happens, it'll happen. I'm waiting on the right one. The, live, the longer I'm live, more people come. Hang on, I'm going to stay live all day, y'all. I'm going to just leave it running. Leave it running. I could come back once I'm dressed, though. Why? It was all I've been on YouTube this morning. It was buffering and buffering. It took me four times. Might as well stay that way. On. But anyway, um, <laughs> I might just live too much. I, I don't like being in the lobby, nobody talking to me. You say I'm staring at the morning, everybody trying to run errands and stuff. Like, I need to go to the grocery store. 
give them for splits across three venues. Then that's I mean, South Veterans don't. Memorial Coliseum in cool. New York, the Rosemont Horizon in Illinois, and the Los Angeles Memorial mm -hmm. Sports Arena in LA. Each separate event was put on simultaneously, with the roster being divided into three individual cards. The televised event would flip. Well, I guess I go back in. I want to know if anybody hit the Mega Millions. Mr. T fought in a boxing match against Roddy Piper, a uh, oh, five times mm. match, and the real main event of the evening, Hulk Hogan defeating King Kong Bundy. I guess I read some of my Facebook messages. How about that? Tone Low. I'm going to call back. I'm like, what's up, Tone Low? No, I ain't going to call him back. Hell no. You call him once, they keep calling him. Anyway. Jingle bells. You said me a cash out. <laughs> Don't let your last cash out. How does your mama do it? Jingle lane, jingle lane, jingle lane, jingle lane. Yeah, I better stop. I get so W E T T S and E's. Oh, breakfast was good, honey. One thing about breakfast. Put it in the stove, put it, do it up. You can always use microwave and be doing it because when you get the munchies, well, you get midday hungry. Breakfast, all, breakfast is good anytime. They don't get what nobody's like. And y'all see what I'm about to do with my boy. Put it back in here. Put the rice and the bacon up. You ain't got to eat here. That means I ain't got to cook later. You ain't got to eat me once around here. We got people come out and eat it for you. Like my mama's shit. This shit let me go. I'm never getting no bacon. It's on the phone. I think, you know, I think running lying to me. I bet you five dollars. He got him something else to eat at McDonald's. No, I got a damn kid right now. You ate something. You tell me you're going to tell me that damn well. Tell me a lie. Pretend like you ain't in there. Your ass ate something. I know how you is. Your ass too damn high. That's what's wrong with you. So you about smoking all them damn blunts. And the way out my child, the devil is a lie. What? Everything else I go around here. Well, that's what you think you can go ahead, mama boy. You want to go to your mama's house? Go ahead, ain't nothing gonna stop you. Let me tell you something about me. I don't taste no nigga, no queer, no steer. You want to go to your mama's house? Get your ass on. She had you. I ain't got no son, mama's boy. Don't be smart, hon. I be Al Green on your ass with them rice. Talk shit to me. I cook you something. Boy, I slap the devil out of you. Excuse me, y'all. Oh yeah, I'm back, y'all. I am back, back, back. I'm thinking I take this in the big room. Hell no, this is my house. I'm gonna sit right here and do what I want to do. Oh, shit, and I'm gonna eat what you kiss and crap on my ass. Wait, wait, I'm back. Listen, this is a beautiful Saturday. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Mike, 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 Mike oh, ooh, what's up? What's up, Nate? Debating on dinner tonight. I'm gonna make some uh, salmon patties and tomatoes and rice. Mike made bread, ziti ham, and some soda bit. Oh, that sounds good. Very healthy. I cooked my vegetables and big dinner on Sunday. Tonight, we're gonna be uh, salmon patties, salmon coke cakes, and uh, Spanish rice. Some easy and to the point, but I'm just cooking for me. Cause mama's boy going to Cherry Street with a mouth like that. Yes. Sitting like he dead. Ain't shit wrong with him. Just too fucking high. Come on, y'all. Let's kick it. Bam! Kick it. That's why you can't be a stoner. 
<laughs> the world gonna keep stoning on around you, gone while you laying there, dead looking up. Valuable time, God bless you, but you laying in sleep in La La Land on cloud 20. And the world moving at 100 pace. I wonder what the hell wrong with him. Shit. He <laughs> gonna quit laying on my damn shelf. <laughs> Y'all let me quit. I'm laughing at my own self. But that sounds good, Nate. I'll be there. Are you gonna go live with it? You already went live. It's just gonna be an upload with something to eat. Yeah, I don't think you feel good. I don't know what's wrong. You don't feel good, Ron? Are you just tired? No motivation. Yeah, he done turned the chick chicky tone, the lizard. <laughs> Y'all remember my chicky tone? That smoke most of all. We didn't want to do shit, but lay back. That was wrong. I'm having a lazy day. Run, are you hurting? No. You just want to lay down? No. Well, go to sleep, boy. You're too high. That's all. I'll be damned. Breakfast time, sausage, egg, cheese, and home fries. That sounds good, baby. You know what I had? I had me some uh, cheese and eggs, pro 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 provolone cheese, Italian cheese. Made it oh so good. I didn't have grits. I put some rice. Yes, rice and butter. Yes, it's a country tradition. Or you can put sugar on it because rice ain't it, but grits and grits ain't never rice. But then um, I cooked some toast and um, bacon, turkey bacon, yes, and had ate it all here. And he's talking about he's sick, which I know he already went somewhere and got something else to eat. Probably his girlfriend. I was going to give a damn, but I'm not going to waste my food on his ass. And I'll just put him, eat some seconds with myself. To my, he tired. Hell no. We would give you three things. Hunger, happy, sleeping. Hunger, he already ate happy. Hell no, his head napping. And he's sleeping. Ha. <laughs> Too much marijuana blunts ain't good for nobody, honey. But smoking the wrong strand will get it. Look, I'm nervous. I said, I guess the fuck you is nervous. Lizard, lizard, lizard. Here, lizard, lizard. <laughs> yeah, I'm just poking fun at it. But anyway, it is what it is. You see, I asked him, I gave my sister, are you all right? Yes. Are you this? No. Are you what? I just want to lay back. Lazy itis. And smoking too much CBD and H and full tag, two hashtag 20 will put you on your ass. And they'll call it sit in. <laughs> I know, honey, because I see him every day. When I go live, y'all know they're doing <laughs> sleep. And I had like nine blunts and shit. With and look, my cousin Richard got some new shit. You're gonna try it with him. They're gonna ride around in a four wheeler. And look, look at him now on his ass. And Ron said, I'll be back. I know where the hell he's going. He going to get him to hook, get the hook up. <laughs> Hashtag 420. I'm a heavy smoker. Hell, he is too shit. I call him Stoner Boy. He's a fucking stoner dude. <laughs> I'm on the blunt 10 already and still moving around. Shit, running on had 20. And guess what? He laying it down. Comatose? Hell no, ain't nothing wrong with him. He'll sleep. Get about two. Give him three hours. He'll get up and be ready to eat. Nice weather, too. It's warming up. He'll be up. No, he got that shit. See, we just told him to sit down. That's what he call it. And what it is ain't nothing but loud and perk mixed together because you can see the purple in it. He smoked too much. He don't know how to smoke. He just smoking, smoking, smoke, 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 smoke. Smoke city, bitch. And I look, this we smoke his ass on the chair. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't shit wrong with him. Let me put some Cat Williams on. He'll be up in the lab like, damn, damn, damn. And it's nice and warm here, too. Yeah, so he all right. And I, I, he already anyway because I know he got to have um, I need a haircut too. He just like to sleep. He's sleeping now. I need to be quiet so he can sleep. Yeah, I woke up this morning. I was scared, scared that fuck out of him. He was like, hey, Joey. it's like his soul jumped out of his body. Looked at him like, what the fuck, bro? Jump back in. I'm like, what? I always scare the hell out of him. <laughs> I do. Yeah, and I be scaring the fuck out of his ass. I love it too. Like, pick your ass up. What? 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 <laughs> oh, I'll be on blunt 30 by the afternoon. I know I'm about to hit me some shit. I ain't mad. I, I can't smoke a whole blunt though. I put two or three pulls and I cough and that's it. I let it go. I'm going to go call you a, 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 a seasonal smoker. I know it's hot as hell in here, though. See that? Mm. 
But please believe, I promise you, between now and the next 30 minutes, it'll be very easy. He's just so high. And when you get high, you got to go sleep about three or four fucking hours for you think about doing anything. Oh, I've been high before. Man, I was one time, man, I swear. I was home by myself. I can tell you, my, I remember my stepdaddy, rest in peace, Jane Milk, came over him. It helped me move some of my stuff, you know. It was my little sister, daddy, Jane, my mom, my second husband. My dad named James Charles, and she married James Thomas. My See, James Charles Little, James Thomas Little. My mama got a thing with James. I don't know why. But she married him, and uh, my dad and James are, were first cousins or whatever. But, uh, you know, time went on. You know, my daddy went his way. My mom went his way in their second marriage. And uh, James, I call him dad, come over here. Help me move some stuff, him and Terry, and Uncle Lee, and Aunt Kathy, you know, we get together, and then we go up there, and Jennifer, shit, we have a good time, in other words, we're moving some stuff with me and all that, so, and uh, he was like, they was like, how long is it going to take you to get ready, right, Stacy? I said, maybe next Sunday, I said, how many Sundays is it going to take you? I said, just one Sunday, Jane, I'm calling him So he going back there later, get here. Yeah, copyright me. I don't give a shit. I ain't like I'm monetized. Good Tell us about this because I know it's going to be a right on. I didn't stand with it. I'm going to turn it down. Yeah, I just. Yeah, there we go. I done seen all this, though. Anyway, y'all, what y'all doing today? Let me turn it down a little bit. I'm about to skill it. Uh, Severus, son. Uh, today is Tuesday 14. Y'all might hear a little bit about the court. Well, yeah, huh? Somebody reported me. That's how that happened. Because you know what? YouTube don't come in like, well, when you get about to get monetized, they will start watching your channel. So they're watching me. So let me stay in compliance. I'm going to get that 1K. Get my grandson cheeseburger money and for his college friend. Now, my grandson already signed up. I'm just, you know, let's go to the kitty to our channel. June the 15th. <laughs> well, anyway, you know, one thing, um, we content creators got to stop saying, what we going to do with our money? When you make your money, that's your money. Do what the fuck you want to do with it. I mean, I invest in my kids. I, I'm proud to say that. My kids and my grandkids. So that's the reason why I'm here. Anyway, oh God, man, I ain't, I ain't ready to get off here yet. I ain't. Shit, you too. Wait. You better wait. You're going to take my subscribers and guess what? Two words for you. Suck it. Oh, yeah. Ain't the news on? Oh, God. So it's 10 50 a.m. Um, I think what I'm going to do now because I got some things I got to do. Y'all gonna stick with me? I stay here. <laughs> oh, oh, mama boy, going to sleep with a good time to go to the store, cut the road. Y'all can take y'all with me. Shit, on my phone here. Y'all know me. I take y'all. We stream y'all this shit all the way up up the road. Damn <laughs> back. Yeah, I took y'all to the store last time. I gotta learn how to use that app anyway. So, what I'm gonna do is uh, sit down. But I'm gonna come back up. We're gonna take a drive in the echo. Yeah. We ain't going nowhere. We're just local. I might go up there to the store, but me $5 in that damn slot machine. I want money from y'all. Remember that shit? I took y'all my own. I took y'all with me. I don't know. Yeah, but anyway, I'm going to get off here for a little while. I'll be back on about 7 o'clock live on this computer. Um, I'm going to do StreamYard VIP panel, open panel. So come on up, get you a cup of your favorite beverage. I don't give a damn. It's gin, wind, whatever make you see. Come on in, because it's prime time with Carolina D. Just you and me. So anyway, y'all, I love y'all so much. I'm going to check out y'all channels um, while I'm gone. Well, part of me want to end it, but part, part of me don't. But, you know, it is what it is. I got to edit that part out. Lady J, you in the building. Who's here? I know... Uh, <laughs> I can probably guess. I can do this anyway. This is how you know you, who's in your chat. You click on off your name. You guys get all that shit out of the way. Go up to the top three. You say participants. Click on that, and it'll tell you who in the chat. All I see is just me, but shit, I must got some new people watching me. Or then you got people that don't have a channel, and they're not. They're private. You don't see them. 
But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna end this chat. Come on back. Um, I'll take you guys with me. I'll probably take a pause or something. I don't know, but I don't go nowhere. I'll come back on here. Y'all watch it. Y'all like a smash that like, but I got 13 thumbs up and I fucking hate it. I want 14. Can I get 14? I don't like the number 13. I don't, I don't, I don't. It's like going on the road to see a black can't you put a fucking X in your window? No, no, I don't like June 13. I don't like Nick 13. But you know what? I remember March 13, 1980. Our house burned down. I must, oh Lord. I remember walking up my grandma's house in drawers. Oh. Yeah, we got us a new place. Don't go run our anime me. I ain't fan of Bill. Mom and daddy. We all stayed with my aunt. That was growing up. My mom had me at 19. Yep, and then me and my daddy. I'm trying to go. My grandpa shot him in the ass with some shotgun pellets. Cause he was telling my mom told my mom that my daddy married her and turned her. I've got to knock double turn against my granddad. <laughs> this point, but it's you. I'm dead had to go through here to get my mom. He got to go through a couple book shots or two. Then they told him somebody. My granddaddy play man and shit. He hit my uncle Kool Aid out here with a fucking hammer. You motherfucker, boom! You trying to fight my uncle? Uh -uh. Back in them days, y'all know men try to fight they women, and the strong one beat the hell out of the man down here. <laughs> You go, you get up the damn juke joint, liquor, make you drink a fight. You're going to do two things with liquor. When you get fucked up, you're going to fuck or you're going to get fucked up. And down here in the 70s and 80s, that's what they do. Go from house to house, get drunk Friday, have a party for everything, rent party. Just because party. It's Wednesday party. Well, let's fucking have a party. It's, it's every day around here, honey. It was a party every day. Everybody sold liquor, honey. Moonshine. Back in them days. They don't do it much now. I know they get caught, but every Friday night, my grandma bought a house to fucking fight. I ain't Uncle Gene, Uncle shit. Uncle Roy ain't in the mate. Uncle Kool Aid ain't ain't fan of Bill. Who else? Anybody married? Shit. Ain't Mary Lee. Ain't Mary Lee could be fighting John David. John David fighting ain't everybody fighting. That's how we handle shit. Boom, boom, get drunk. Let's fight. Boo, y'all. Now, granddad, not being, you, you better get them niggas out of here. And that's my granddad coming out with a shotgun. Bam, everybody gone. Shit. And then we'll start getting in the car and start drag racing on Saturday. My Uncle Kool Aid come out with his motorcycle. Emmanuel Brewery. I remember it was bad motors. Like my uncle Lee Tom had a 67 Chevelle and Uncle Ray Lee had a 966 Nova. We call it Tornado Kenny Phillips. Hot damn. That was a bad boy. Everybody wanted him. And what else? Who else going on? Dumas. Dumas just come out with his shit. There's a bad call. But that dude had a bad ride, though. I ain't gonna lie. Uncle Kool-Aid, shit. You could tell my uncle motherfucking thing. He went in everything. On a motorcycle. And my cousin Richard taught me how to ride a motorcycle when I was like eight. My cousin Larry Love showed me how to be a black belt at the age of four. Yeah, they must know I was going to be a sergeant major or something. All of them did something like, yeah, they're going to look soldier girl. <laughs> I go around and say, I'm going to join the army. I'm going to be all I can be in the army. And that's how that went. And that's how I ended up being in the military so long. My youngest daughter's in the, in the army. Just military, God, fair, and love, love people. Go to church type of people. Have fun. Hell, you're going to get drunk, get drunk. Don't have to do it, do it to it. <laughs> That's what kind of family is shit. Mistakes don't kill you, they make you strong around him. Hell yeah, you live to fight another day. That's the good thing about it. And that's what's wrong with this society. They don't take out the fist and fight like men and women are supposed to. You know, boom, 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 boom. Might get a black guy, might be in the hospital, get stabbed in the fucking bag, but ain't nobody gonna kill you. Just give your ass with him. It's like getting you know, a ass with him, ass with him. Well, you one day you're gonna get tired of getting your ass whooped, you're gonna even commence to whoop somebody's fucking ass. You know, drinking liquor and shit. Man, I mean, you know, two drunk folks can't fight no damn. Like, come on, y'all. Everybody just be laughing. And this kid is always do laughing at my grandma's house, laughing at my uncle's house. Everybody around here selling liquor. We just laugh, 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 laugh. And then when everybody turn their head, guess what? We turn it up, 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 boom. Me, I like beer. My brother and sister, they like liquor. Shit. That was just the way it is. But I know I get my ass whooped because I know if I get in that mountain and make, ooh, Lord, she's gonna kill me dead. You can't get caught drinking look at y'all stealing from your parents and shit when you look here. You gotta be smooth with it. When they turn it back and they fussing, or they band up gotta make another brother or sister, just sip in the bud while boo y'all. And then go outside, skip around while stay outside for a good while. Hell yeah, cause when you get that first buzz and it's your first beer ever, you're gonna be in the cone field trying to smoke fucking cigarettes. This don't drop the cigarette, set the shit on fire like I did. No. That's what I got my first ass when we get caught getting drunk. Yeah, I finished cooking Ashley. I'm sitting here now. What you about to do? 
I'm just sitting there telling people how it is right here when I'm growing up and getting drunk and shit. Growing up. Even my daughter said, oh, yeah, mom. I had 15 cans of beer like you did. I said, damn, the fruit don't fall from the tree. <laughs> well, the difference between me and my daughter is I drink beer. My daughter, she she just like to sample a couple of drinks of liquor every blue moon. Oh, man, I can't hold it. I get drunk off a can of beer. I'm a piss poor drinker. And I thank God for that. But I used to put them down, though. Now it's just coughing so much. Pay me the money, y'all. Yeah, you know your life changed when you become a grandma. When my grandson came down here and a couple things happened, I was like, fuck it, I don't need to drink. I need my grandkids, I need my children. Shit, I'm a homebody. So I just love it. You don't tell me what's real, young lady. You at ease, your shit. I'm your mama. I'm grown. I can do what I want. I'm grown than you and I love you. There ain't nobody here but you and me. Yeah, y'all. Ashley, so what you about to do, though? I'm going to call you. But I think I'm going to go take me a ride. Yeah, I'm going to go to the store. Take you, I don't know what the hell I'm going to do. Ashley, so what should I be doing right now? Let me come out of Virginia. They wear the hell out of you. <laughs> no, baby, ain't going to make it to Virginia today. Yeah, cool. I'm thinking about going to Fant Walmart. Yeah, Ashley. Oh, yeah, Ashley. And I need you to text me um Ava's uh, address because I got the present I got to send to her. Oh, yeah, Kiki Nichols under there. The rest of that shit is what y'all sent me. And I already showed them that. So, ain't that the show? I need to take this treat. I'm going to slide that motherfucking. You know what? That's exactly what I'm going to do. And slide that chair back. Yes. Hold on, y'all. Let's take this cushion tree down. I promise y'all we're going to do that. Because I didn't consider anything I to consider January 6th is bad. Look. Here the power. I had two accidents last year because my truth was still fucking up. We're going to have 2022. You're going to have no bad luck now. No. We'll take this shit down right now. Xbox. Christmas. Xbox. Bath and body wash my daughter. Ash Lurie. Yes, I'm going to use something that the This ain't no prison. This right here with my grandson. He watching his cartoon. He'll take his head and bump his head and go, pow! I'm like, damn. He used to kick so much, I just laughed my boot up. So I'm going to just apply this. I'm going to get this to my mom anyway. And sanitizer. Wipe your hands. Sanitizer. I'll show y'all a minute. I might give some of this shit away because when I go buy things, I buy it in bulk. And this right here is my daughter bought me this. My daughter actually, like Kiki. Some Ralph Lauren perfume. Yeah, I gotta go get that frame for my daughter, man. Kiki Wayne. These are boxes. My grandson has some Nike shoes. And what the hell is here? Oh, uh, present my daughter had me. What was that? I can't remember. These believe it's probably in this tree. And it's trash. I got trash. This. Trash. Uh, Ronnie's. And Ashley's present. Okay. This is my granddaughter's shit. This stuff. So. It's like I gotta mail it all. And guess what? Another company box. My daughter asked about this, y'all. I got some perfume back there, she bought me too. And can y'all see this gold necklace I got on? My daughter Ashley, my big girl. Miss Lady J gave me those. And so, guess what, y'all? This is how I'm gonna take down the tree. Oh, put it in the bag. Well, I'm the tree. Guess I'm gonna slide this shit back in that back room. <laughs> and the tree gonna be taken down. That is. 
Yeah, I'll probably take it down sometime this week. But right now, with this arthritis I got, I'm hurting. So, I'll get to it sometime. But look how easy it is. Just grab it by the middle and drag it. I'm dragging to my story on back there. And she'll be in my office. Be right back, y'all. Well, I owe the old and with the new. Happy New Year, y'all. 2023, not 2022. All Damn, he said, Well, man, you don't know where you at? Peter Ristro. What you're wondering, you right 
you will like that too. She We'll talk about that later. Your problem seems to be right now. I have a proposition to offer you, Are you willing to listen? Your proposition to always wind up on top. Just like the shit that you done to have in the oh, I was young, man. My style today. My style today is much more sophisticated. But what do you want from me now? A song. <laughs> How in the hell did I do a lie? I said, Big Mary, and I don't. What's in the deal? Gaze upon the little spores. Boxes in my car. Shit. How long have you got? I'm on my keys. I ain't said that, Lord. So you don't lie. I knew it was them. Big fat, sloppy son of a bitch. Yes, they don't threaten that I got coming shopping time. Well, why kill a little boy like that in cold blood? If you would just calm down a moment and listen, perhaps we can work things out together. Marry my daughter and give her a child. And I will arrange it for you to have your life back. To strut and fret your hour on the stage again. Revenge will be yours, Petey B. Strong. As a man, as a man, you've got to be thick. Well, Petey, prepare to die. Marry your daughter and give her this son that you need so bad. By the way, what does your daughter look like? Gee, I hope you has nothing you to do with our proposition. <laughs> what about you, man? No, 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 I won't marry the deal. No deal. Yeah, I, I still can't, oh, can't find my keys. Oh, my purse. Yes, it will be as though none of this ever happens. <laughs> Take me to the car. Uh, from Echo, go for a ride. I'm going to the to Yo, it's still cold out right there. Yeah, this on the floor. Put it on the table. What? Oh, all right, all right. Yeah, hey. Come here. No, man, you can't do it. Give me pretty boxes in my hand. Right. Well, you gonna bring it to the dough? Right there on the side. Huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yourself, you just have to be a low down like you want to go to sleep. Yeah, just, well, right. go back and go to fucking sleep then. Let's go. Get out of my life, my seat. Hey, you damn right. All right. Hey, your ass ain't sick. All right, all right. Get the fuck out. Ain't nobody tell anybody to stop the double hitting you in your ass. Shit. I don't chase no man or no boy. You want to go, go. Oh, Jesus. Nobody come through the land we pumped this morning. Nobody. I'm quiet. I get shit on so your girlfriend. Has she fucked waiting on you anyway? Well, you slow down over there. What about you? Let's get it. You gone? Is it? Oh, yeah. Halfway done, y'all. <laughs> Damn, they would be just stuck the stake in that out of here. Yeah, Xbox. Y'all, this is what I got an Xbox One S. And about to get a PS5. I all right, y'all. I'm getting there. So, but sure, I'm getting there. I think I'm pretty much done. I'm going to get some of these pills out. I can't stand to be pills. I'm going to check it out. It'll just be fine with this. This shit over here. Who oh, ain't going no damn way? Just think somebody's going to baby it. I'm about nobody's child. Yo, what you got a mama for? You want to get baby take your ass down your mama house, mama boy? I ain't baby nobody. You ain't sick. What the fuck you want me to do? I'm no doctor. Yeah, it's gonna feel good. And most shit you don't eat in my house, I gotta cook for myself. I cook for no man, I cook for me. Facts, y'all, really. So, what y'all see is what, what happens. I can't even supposed to see here like you all that. A man must conform to a woman. A woman's supposed to conform to no fucking man. He made us smart, not strong, dumb. Well, he got made us strong, smart, and independent. He just made two nuts come together. That's all. Poor oh, man. <laughs> Don't take it personal. <laughs> Okay, y'all. I'm done for now, but you know the only thing I want. I should have put my table back over here, but I like the table over there something different, you know? Yeah. Oh, God, that's good to see that. I ain't got much to do today. But, yeah, I don't like that. Um, I think I need to pull that chair a little bit more. Probably. I'm um, shoot. 
Oh uh, yeah, I can put matter of fact, that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm gonna see what I'm about to do, y'all. Put it back like it originally was. This ain't working for Carolina Diamond. Carolina Diamond like it when it go bling bling. Dress right dress, you know what I'm saying? So this back over here. Oh, do I have them over here? Ooh, do I have over here? Shit, that motherfucker ain't going nowhere. Well, you got the shit. I think really got the stomach virus. You got a stomach virus. What do you need to pick up your for? Yeah, you shit all the time. Yeah, you probably got yeah, you got a stomach virus. Yeah, what you need to do is this, go get you some um, cups up here. Yeah, yeah. Same thing sweet pepper day. It might be the gallbladder. I don't know. I need gallbladder. You'll feel the go to mercy room all the time. I know from the dark. I just I know I can take care of my kids. I'm not taking no grown ass man. Do, do you feel weak? It might be your dog, but I don't know. Well, I'll go to the emergency room. You should be concerned about it. I'm not going to be stepped up this. I'm going to be some new dude. I don't know who did it. And you went twice as my age. You know what the fuck to do with your butt? Oh, you know your butt? Shit, now I ain't no goddamn David Copperfield. I'm basically little. What the hell are you doing? You don't stay with me. Stay with your mama, boy. Go ask your mama. My mama's boy needs to go ask his mama, because I don't know. Anyway, y'all, that's better. I'm going to pull this closer. Yes. Push that down, son. There we go. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, it's hot. I know it's about 60 degrees. That guy got an air come home. No, it's close it though. Oh, that ain't going in it. You're getting my fucking nerves already. Ain't going out there smoke, smoke goddamn weed. I swear that boy was sick. He's sick in the head. Yeah, it's me. I'm going to move up. No mail today. Yeah, we're going back in the bedroom. Shit. Yeah, I'm going to the bedroom. Yeah, because I can be myself back in my bedroom. I got to get up in a minute clean up. Uh, let me see. Brandon Recovery, what's going on, baby? 
Happy uh, Sensational Saturday. Um, I've been on, I don't know how long I've been live, y'all. I haven't looked at the screen yet, but um, Obama's boy going to the doctor. He ain't feeling good. Or in soil. He's going to get his bottles checked. Yeah, yeah, so I convinced him to go, so he's going. He's going to Chirau, which is about nine miles away. I'm going to give him some pills, and he don't want to take go sell them and get his more weed. <laughs> Damn. Boy, I tell you, that's what's problem. He smoked too much weed. He need to drink more water. Stop drinking too much coffee. And this infuriated. Might be a dog, but I, took, I don't know. So that's why I told him to go to the doctor. She had a terrible fear of rejection from males. Vera set a course for revenge, but in a way that preserved the adoration of the men who followed. Everybody wants to be loved. And once you have it, you always want to have a love. And we usually go on. We'll mourn the loss or grieve or move on to something else to replace it. We don't kill. There are replaced love from the living with love from the dead. She killed for more than a decade until a suspicious wife called police to Vera's basement. Well, it's much better back here. That's true. They found 35 zinc coffins. You feeling better than um, turning the fan on? It's a little warm. Got two people watching this last year started three hours ago. Got the four hour mark. I'm gonna get out here. Oh, I don't see anybody. Oh, I don't see anybody. Well, yeah, I'm watching myself on the screen TV, so let me see. Oh, Jesus, I'm tired. Cook with his boy, and he just run down the road and just had surgery. I'm gonna have a second surgery on the 13th, and we just, I don't know, it's, it's just relentless, you know, especially when somebody don't listen to you. And that's our biggest thing, we are always at each other, though. He think he know everything. But I said, that's so rude. No, it ain't. No. Oh, uh, just, just man, what's going on, baby? Nice and round. <laughs> yeah, we was watching Dolomite, but I had to cut it down because Brandon, I don't know if I'm talking to you, but hello, hello, darling, how you doing? I think I'm watching Rudy watching me too. Maybe Ashley. I don't know who's here. But when I was looking at Dolomite, this copyright strike thing came to my copyright may be taking your live so you could be temporary blocked. So I went mute. So um what I want to do now is go ahead. Do I edit it now or right when I put this? But I guess it does not matter as long as you don't publish it. So I'm going to just edit uh two hours and two hour mark to two hour twenty mark, and that's gonna be that. So make this a three hour. I'm gonna say three hour twenty minutes because I'm gonna edit twenty minutes out of my own. I think actually no, I'm not because I can just go live again. Tell you what, guys, I'm gonna end this live stream, edit that little part, and I'll be back on ten minutes. All right. Much love, y'all. Peace. And y'all check out everybody else's live stream. Let me see if I can edit it now. Hold up. Nope, they ain't gonna let me do it. Details, customization, and see. Hell no, I ain't gonna let me do it. I'm not gonna uh, literally just let YouTube come because sometimes when that shit come up, you know, they don't do it, but I believe I'm gonna have a copyright uh, copyright claim. Not a strike. So it is what it is. You know, I don't have so many strikes. You have not been a great YouTuber yet until, 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 you know, I can make it private and then edit it. That's right. You get a copyright strike. And I'm saying I probably had 2,000 copyright strikes. Participants who's in the building ain't telling me. It's not telling me because you know this YouTube thing is not the studio is not never working right. But Jess, Maddie, Rudy, uh, Rudy um, Brandon's recovered. Thank you guys for being here. Nate, the great one, Lady J, my, my master Maya, which is my daughter Ashley Nicole. Y'all see that little girl? That, well, she's a little girl. She's a lovely. She's a daughter of mine. That's New Year. The braids. That's my daughter Ashley. Y'all look at my hair. I need to do something to mine too because I had that Santa Claus suit on earlier. 
in the live stream. But 15 um, thumbs up before people to build it. But I'm going to end this live stream. I'm going to come back to the show, okay? So give me about five minutes. I'll be back. Love you, minute, child. Yeah, because I want to get that out of there. I want to see what it's going to do. I'll be back. I ain't going to get no copyright strike because I ain't done anything yet except this one. Peace out, y'all. Five minutes. I ain't going to get no copyright strike because I ain't done anything yet except this one.